Good evening, everyone. Welcome to Monday Night Twitch. I'm your host, Mike the Wandering Took. Joining me tonight is not Daniel. Miss you, buddy. He's on vacation with his family, so uh, we wish him a good rest. Uh, but joining me in his stead is, of course, Catherine, who is along for Hi. the ride with Trish again. Hello, how are you doing? Yes, I'm doing well. Looking forward to this different experience. With Luke and Trish and somebody else. And somebody else. Yeah. Welcome back, Ben McDog. How are you, sir? Hello. I'm doing good. You've been a lot. You've been uh, on a lot. <laughs> Recently, yeah, I have been. <laughs> it's great. It's great. Thanks for filling in. I see you brought Tony Morgan. Would you like to give a quick rundown of what your deck is? Uh, sure. So, uh, this deck, uh, you know, Rogue with Guardian splash in there. And the whole idea is to get Chuck Fergus out, which I have in my opening hand, luckily. Yay! And play all sorts of tactic and trick events um, really fast or get higher skill value. Just some good old tricks with Chuck. Sounds and 20, did I hear you said 29 experience in your deck? Uh, yes, 29 experience. That's over twice so what we have. Yeah. <laughs> Tony is a very well vetted bounty hunter, so Yeah. Good. He is one of my favorites. He is. I've never seen him play with this many with like, you know, in a standalone scenario. So I will oh. be very curious to see how this works. Well. Now Catherine, you have played this, right? I have. Okay. Yes. But Ben has not. Oh, okay. Is that right, Ben? Yes, I got a chance to play when it first came out. That is correct, yeah. We just haven't gotten to this one yet. Okay. Well, in that case, what do you think, Catherine? Should we make him lead investigator? Oh, yeah, sure. All right. This is one of those that works better when you're going in blind as lead. Um, but don't worry. Okay. When you play mm -hmm. it later, uh, you will have a very different game because this is one of those scenarios that has... 14 different paths, I think. Yeah, I remember seeing like all the different like act cards or something. There's yeah. like a whole bunch of one of the cards. So, <laughs> yeah. All right. Now, of I, course. I still have only, like, when I say I've played it, I've played it twice. <laughs> yeah. So I have only seen a tiny portion of yep. what this scenario has to offer. I have seen one. It was grand. Mm hmm. All right, well, so we'll see um, what we get tonight. I mean, this is this is Inception here. I mean, this is a flashback from within a flashback. We were at Devil Reef, and we almost woke up, and then we remembered. Oh yeah, there was a time before uh, before Thomas <laughs> Dawson. There was a time before Alina Harper, and that time we were we were summoned to a mysterious hotel with our old friend Tony Morgan. And uh, to reflect that, we don't have any trauma, because why not? We're already breaking a whole bunch of rules, just bringing Tony in. <laughs> <laughs> and not spending experience and all that. But uh, here we are. This is this is what happened a long time ago. And I, I hope you enjoyed the story. I'm sure it will be very entertaining. And if not, I will splice this out. <laughs> <laughs> we're going we're gonna to earn lots of XP for Daniel. That's, that's right. That's, that's the right. goal. <laughs> <laughs> Get him a few shotguns. All right. <laughs> Murder at the Excelsior Hotel. There have been reports of strange occurrences at Arkham's Excelsior Hotel for over a month now. Disappearances, bizarre sightings, sudden closures, sometimes for days at a time, seemingly without warning. It's like something out of a ghost story, but you know better than to simply dismiss these rumors. Too many people have whispered about the Excelsior. And to make matters worse, it seems the stories have only grown more unsettling in the last week. It's time somebody looked into it all. You tried going to the police, but the grizzled and world-weary Sergeant Monroe has dismissed you every time. You've been left to investigate on your own. Asking around at all the local hotspots yields no leads. Thelma's Diner, Hibbs Roadhouse, La Bella Luna, each visit leaves you with only more questions. That is, until today. While walking down Central Avenue in downtown, minding your own business, you bump into a man in a long trench coat. You begin to apologize, but he simply continues walking briskly away from you. It isn't until you return home that you find the note in your pocket, one that wasn't there before. I have answers. Room 225. Tonight. Come alone. They're watching. 
Uncertain of what else you can do at this point, you begin preparations to meet this mystery person. The Excelsior is busy tonight. Whoa. <laughs> Someone's throwing furniture. See, the, oh. the Excelsior is busy tonight. <laughs> I did... closed the door. Did it sound like somebody <laughs> threw a furniture? It's, uh, it does <laughs> fun audio tricks. It sounded like a very busy hotel. Oh, wow. Sorry. Either the rumors haven't phased these guests, or the stories have, have given the hotel a new allure. Everything seems normal. Hotel staff carry <clears throat> luggage and cleaning supplies throughout the lobby and the main stairway. The man behind the front desk greets you with a cart and with a curt nod and a thin smile. A uniformed security guard reads the latest Arkham advertiser in the corner. And yet, you can't get the note's final warning out of your mind. You stride quickly across the lobby and up the stairs, taking some measure of comfort in the knowledge that you at least contacted others you could trust, letting them know of your whereabouts and intent. Your clandestine meetings have rarely gone as planned, especially lately, and it never hurts to have some measure of backup. You stand before the blood red door to 225, take a deep breath, and knock. There's no going back now. You sit in a chair in the suite's living room, watching as the man who slipped you the note paces about nervously. He rambles about secret meetings and watchful staff. The entire time, you find yourself glancing to the coffee table in front of you, and the curved dagger that rests there. He pauses for a moment, pours himself a drink, and raises the glass to his lips with a shaky grip. He then pours a second drink and hands it to you. This is all going to sound crazy, he says, his voice little more than a whisper. He glances at every darting shadow and twitches at every creak the old building makes. I'm beginning to feel crazy, but there's too much going on here to just ignore, and I've been a part of it long enough. You listen closely, but his words are starting to run together. His voice is ethereal and wispy, like wind at the end of a long tunnel. You blink rapidly. Your vision blurs. The next thing you know, you're on your feet. Your glass drops to the floor, and then... Set up. Okay. Ben, you are in 225. Trish and Luke are in the foyer. Oh, okay. We are acting as your backup. The lead investigator. I'm running away from you quickly. <laughs> we've been here. He was asked to come alone. Okay. Uh, ben, you've got something in your hand. I do? Yep. Oh, I do. You've got a bloodstained dagger. The murder weapon. Throw that shit. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yes. Everything else is put away for now. That's it. And then there will be an interlude later. Ooh, interludes. There will. Ben, this time I'm going to get you to read the agenda deck. And right. probably the room, the room uh, flavor as well. That's right. Yeah. Since he's there alone, we don't know. All right. Agenda one: the murder. When you come to, you are standing over the man's body. You recoil immediately at the grisly sight. Multiple stab wounds perforate in his perforate his chest. Blood spills onto the floor. What in the hell happened here? Why can't you remember a thing? Uh, if there's only one investigator in the game, this agenda gets plus one doom threshold. Well, that's nice of them. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Catherine. What happened? Your head is spinning as you try to make sense of the situation. Empty bottles are scattered about the room. Your hands tingle. The shadows seem to coil and writhe around you. Were you drugged? Or is this something else entirely? All right, spend one clue per investigator as a group and draw the top card of the leads deck. If the investigators control two lead assets, advance. So that's like, up what here? leads deck? I don't know. <laughs> it's just, I have no idea. We, we're not going to know until we you draw it, but I promise you it is way more fun than the last leads deck we were playing with. <laughs> <laughs> you know, where old people were attacking us. Yeah. That one. <laughs> Okay. Zebulon yeah. and what have you. <laughs> Zebulon, yeah. <laughs> there are five very different leads in here, and this determines the flow of the game. I don't want to say anything more than that. Let's collect some leads. All right. Uh, let's start by opening up room 225. All right. Uh, 
The rug on the floor is soaked with blood. Broken glass litters the couch and coffee table in the living room. The window is open, a chill breeze flowing through the long curtains. Ooh, a test of three willpower. If you succeed, remember that investigators cleaned up the blood. That won't be me. I'll need help with that one. <laughs> uh, test three fists. If you succeed, remember that investigators hid the body. Okay, I can do that. Test three books. If you succeed, remember that the investigators tidied up the room. Tony, what did you do? <laughs> do you have scene of the crime in your deck? <laughs> there might be. I can't remember. <laughs> All right, this is the, the foyer. The foyer is a grand hall of polished tile and sweeping stairs. Guests and staff move through the vast room in an almost dreamlike state. Or is that just your imagination? You can resign. When you attempt to move out of the foyer, while well, there is at least one guest enemy here, test Fleetness X, where X is the number of guest enemies here. If you fail, you must spend an additional action to move out of the foyer. Hmm. There's going to be people in our way. Okay. Stupid it's guests. not a. It's not like yeah, but it's not like a. You can't leave, which I like. I can appreciate. Yeah, Just slower, <laughs> but you can still leave. All right. Um. If people are gonna move, I would appreciate going first so that I can make use of Witten. You know what I've decided, okay? Which is antithetical to how I've played Trish before. <laughs> okay. Let's hear it. I. I think. I should move after people, not just because you have Witten, et cetera, but like, I kind of want to trail in while people, while enemies have been uncovered. I want to, if people are fighting, that's when I want to get in there. Right. And then I can look for, I can double up on clues, potentially evade the enemy, but like, I want to be there when action's already happening and kind of slide in afterwards, not be forging my own Got path it. through the map. I think this is, I think anyway, this will work better. Sounds good to me. So feel free to, I don't think I'll, I'll either investigate here and just use some setup or um, follow you if you uncover something interesting. Okay. Uh, I'm sitting on a drawn to the flame, just so you guys know. Don't know when I'll use it yet, but I am. Yeah, here doesn't seem okay. right yet. Ben, what are you thinking? I mean, I can hide the body. That's about <laughs> it here. <laughs> oh, he's on damage control. Okay. <laughs> yes. Um, um, otherwise, I'm just doing setup, yeah. Thanks. Okay, well, if you're just doing setup, go ahead. I'll move in after that. Okay. Uh, let's go, let's go Chuck. Chuck solves problems. He does. Uh, <laughs> I want to switch blade. I guess that's fast, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, put that out anyways. Uh, let's see. I'm going to try and test to hide the body as my second action. So five to three. And I failed. Let's try that one more time. What? Oh, Ooh. that. That. Yeah, you know what? Can you make a copy of the scenario card? I never feel yes, like I, I can, can do it. I yeah. will just keep it right here for me. Ben, I'm going to put one right above us. Yeah, that makes sense. All right. Well, another minus three. I do not have a clue, so that was just another fail. I guess I can't hide the body. I'm sorry. Well, all right. That's okay. I'm sure it's fine. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm sure. I'm sure. All right. Witch in green is on the table. I don't see a need in Drawn to the Flaming here. I think I will start by... Oh, do I have to exhaust her? To get the draw action. Yeah, just checking that, because I could move twice. Uh, all right, let's move on. Extravagant carpeting runs along the floor, and meticulously clean walls are perforated by blood-red doors. After entering this location, you may immediately move to a connecting location. If you do, reveal a random token from the Chaos Bag. If it's a special symbol, draw the top card of the encounter deck. Uh, you know what? I don't think I need to do that right now. I really don't. I'm going to draw the 
search the top nine cards in my deck, though. And that is not a map. Shuffle that up. So, what have I got here? I've got four, and this is a two. I'm going to investigate with an enraptured. <laughs> oh, <laughs> there it is. All right, we're just getting all the all the bad stuff right away. Yep. And that's my turn. Wow, that would have been uh, that would have been really good for me. Yeah, I'm sure you have another one in your deck. All yep, right. somewhere. I have lock picks. And I will investigate once. Oops. Yeah. So I always have to check your thing. What is this? Yeah. Okay. So I'm at eight. All right. Against two. Okay. Hello. Did not click, maybe. Okay. So I succeeded by three. Uh, no, yeah. by one. I succeeded by one. Oh, right? no, no, my God. Why this is simple addition? <laughs> I succeeded by three. Yeah. Oh, my God. So, I get one clue. Did I just draw another thing and I drew a tentacle? I did not. That was, I don't even know what that is. Ignore that. <laughs> yeah, let's do this. Okay. This goes here. There. Is that and, what you're used to seeing? Oh, yes, yes. Okay. And I, okay, that was one of the things that was different. Okay, um, I'm gonna move after you. Did you want? Oh yeah, you can't get the extra clue unless it's an enemy, right? Yes, that's okay. right. And um, I think I move to. I think I do this. I'm gonna do it, and I'm gonna see. This is the. Um, so if it's any symbol, yep. I'm going to draw Anything. hopefully an enemy. Hey, that's fine. That doesn't I know. That's, count I know that's any... not what you wanted. But... So, it's cool. I'm done. Well, that happened. Okay. One clue. <laughs> okay, so there's no enemies in play. Go ahead and tick that upkeep. I hope you don't expect me to be getting too many clues. <laughs> no, 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 no. We got you covered. We can't help you hide the body either. But <laughs> yeah. Maybe Since we can I... help with something else. Yeah, I, I should be able to hide the body. Hopefully. All right, there is one doom. Uh, just to keep the stream easier, we're going to go uh, Catherine, Ben, myself for a counter card draw. Okay, so me first? Yeah. All right. Yay! Oh, the spawn in the nearest crime scene. Is that here? That is here. Well, okay. Actually, yeah, it is a crime scene. Yep. The prey is, it's me. I have the most clues. <laughs> and okay. it is conspicuous. F. They're not a loo for anything. They are just here. Interesting. Okay. okay. Unless there's something on the act deck that I, I missed, but I, no. There's... I was just looking. I didn't see that. No. I thought there was some aloof people in here. Must be somebody else. It must be somebody else, yeah. These are not... Oh, boy. <laughs> they. These are Hang on, did we shuffle that deck? I certainly didn't. You can check it. Yeah, let me check. Yep, looks like it's shuffled. Okay. Okay. Uh... <laughs> I swear this wasn't on top. <laughs> well, that's all the nearest crime scene. Which is and you then... guys. So who wants yep. it? Oh, uh, it has prey. So... No. Oh, Tony's got some work to do now. <laughs> uh, Tony, are you going to bounty any of these? Oh, yes. I should have been doing that. Oh, man. Yeah, I, I would have done I don't need your first one. Okay. And, um, let's see. And I wish I could have gotten this out. 
Oh well. Better bounty to one of mine. And I'll just leave the other one. <clears throat> Two bounties on this conspicuous staff. <laughs> All right. Okay. Why are they Why are they all piling into the same room? Because <laughs> there's a dead body. <laughs> hey, that works. Hey guys, check this out. That's all right. Um. Yeah. All right. So, uh, who wants to go first? Well, let me look at this for a second. I'm reading a card that I have here. Okay. Yeah, I mean, you means me, right? It doesn't mean everybody. It just means me, so. Correct. Correct. Yeah. They would okay. engage me. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, they're not evaded. They're just, or they're not exhausted. They're just disengaged. Right. So, so they, they would all would, engage you. They would all engage again. Engage Ben. Mm -hmm. Okay. Which isn't terrible, I don't think. Um, what they do? Damage a horror? Hmm. Yeah. If yeah, I did okay. that, if I if I did that, let's say I went first and I disengaged from these two enemies and they engage you, I could then get all three clues potentially, with like one investigation, which I think is good. I think. That's um. Good. But yeah. Don't know if you could handle three or want all three. I won't do it okay. unless you want. Me. Okay, then I'm gonna play that. I'm gonna play Switchblade in the shadows, and they realize that you're the murderer, not me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm. I'm holding the uh, bloodstained day girl, So, so then I will. Uh, the controls are going all over the place. I'm going to investigate here. So I've got eight, nine. Nine to three. Versus three. OK, so I get all. I'm going to take the clues and leave you with that. That doesn't work. I'm going to leave you with all the enemies instead of evading them. Is that OK? Or do you want me to evade one of yours? I'm just not going to. <laughs> I'm just, I, 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 I've decided I'm the clue person and I better do my thing. All right. That's fine. That's one. Let me see if I can quickly tidy up the room. Is that a four? Three. Three. Okay. Uh, nope. Yeah, well three is getting work <laughs> yeah yeah do i discard something i don't remember if i have i'll just i'll just uh try it nope <laughs> okay that was a disaster this room is uh cursed i think a little bit i mean it wasn't a lot of i'm glad i didn't throw in a card out for it but yeah yeah. It's too tough for me. <laughs> this job is, it's, the room is just too messy. I can't handle it. <laughs> All right, Ben. All right, I, I guess I'll go. Okay, so conspicuous staff number one. I'll use my bonus action to fight an enemy. Nice. Uh, using my switchblade, so I'm at seven attack. Well, eight attack, actually, because oh, just seven. Uh, seven against three. Great. Okay, skull. What's that? Uh, there's no oh, guest enemies three. in play, so oh, that's there's no guest. Nice. Okay. Uh, I succeeded by two or more, so this conspicuous staff is gone. I bet those are the aloof ones, the guests. Yeah. Yep. All right, you have three actions left. Yep. And I got three actions. So second action, or uh, for my first real action, I use a switchblade again against this other conspicuous staff. Um, I'll do the one without the bounty. 
seven against three, boom, succeeded by two. I'll succeed by three, so that one is gone. Uh, I will do a switchblade again, I guess. Go against this conspicuous staff. Just clean <laughs> out this room. There we go. Now you've got four bodies to hide. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, so my final action, I am going to try and hide the body again. <laughs> bodies. Well, in, yeah. in the art, there was clearly two staff needles, so that's like seven bodies total now. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm just going to try and hide the body again. Yay! All right. We remember that we hid the body. Okay. That is me. Okay. Yeah, uh, we technically have enough to get a lead if you want to do that on your turn, Mike. But oh, do we? Is it not action? if you have other stuff to do. It is, yeah, an action. Uh. No rush, right? Yeah. Okay. I I want to. get them both at once. I'm still hunting for my map, so I'm going to be a little inefficient and just move around. The white tablecloths seem almost too clean. As you glance through the menu, the words within are entirely unintelligible. Upon second glance, however, everything seems normal. It's spend two resources. You place an order while enduring the withering glares of the, glares of the entire waitstaff. At the end of your turn, if you are still here, you may take one horror to heal three damage. Limit once per game. Ooh. Each location in play is revealed and there are no clues in play place three clues on the restaurant. Okay. So we have an option. That's good. Uh, I also get to look at the top nine cards. My map was at the very bottom. Uh, I think this oh. is a good spot for read the signs, eh? Hey? I don't... Let's take a look. Oh, yeah. Let's just read the signs while I'm here. So I am a four, five, six, seven, eight, nine because of Witten Green on a four. That is a minus zero. So I pick up two clues. You're almost there. I am almost there. Uh, so I guess. Oh, actually, we are there. I have because I have four. Okay, well, let's uh, reveal the first lead then. I'll spend two. You okay. Spend... I'll spend one. The first card of this lead deck is the manager's key. Ooh. Revelation put into play in your play area. When you're defeated, give it to another investigator. A seemingly inconspicuous key, the word office, etched on one side. Was the victim a member of the hotel staff? What diabolical scheme was in motion at the Excelsior? This is exciting. I've never seen this one before. Hmm. Uh, that's me. That's, so that's... So that's all three actions. Oh, okay. Because it's an all action right. to get the lead. Right, right, right. All right, I'll keep. Yep. Hey, hey, that's good. <clears throat> hey, let's go. All right. <laughs> okay, ready? Encounters? Oh, I should probably do the, the doom. There we go. Your encounter card. Have... Hotel guest. Ah, spoon, spawn, not spoon. <laughs> <laughs> In the nearest hall, which I guess is there? Second floor hall, yeah. I don't know where to put it, like there. Patrol. Does that make sense? Oh, right, we have to figure out patrol. Is that in the book? Yep. Okay, during the enemy phase, each ready, unengaged enemy with patrol moves to a connecting location along the shortest path toward the designated location. If there are multiple locations that qualify, the lead investigator may choose. 
If an enemy with patrol would be compelled to move to a location which is blocked by a card ability, the enemy does not move. So she just moves towards the nearest crime scene. And then it says at the end of the enemy phase, if hotel guest is at a crime scene, add one doom to hotel guest. Ah, I see. well, that's awesome because I can very easily get rid of her. But yeah, she's also okay. totally set up for Trish to start getting clues. That's yeah. Cool. Don't don't kill her just yet. No, I will kill <laughs> her. I'm not the I'm not the killy one here. I'm not Mr. Stabby Stabby. <laughs> Well, you said I'm set up to get rid of her. <laughs> Tell her to shoe which, nicely. Which honestly is not, she's, she's not that tough. Just kill her quickly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this affects you uh, too, Catherine. Yeah, so I got noxious fumes <sighs> in player order. Each investigator at your location must choose S3 agility uh, to attempt to flee before the gas fills the room. If you fail, take two damage. Oh, if you succeed, you move to a connecting location. Hmm. Uh, or test three uh, combat to attempt to hold your breath. For each point you fail by, take one damage. All right. Will you go first, Ben? Uh, sure. I'll go first. Um, I okay. guess I will be attempting combat. That seems prudent. <laughs> Uh, so, yep, I'll just do five against three. I'm just going to go with it. Oh, my goodness. Hey. Nice. Woo. New bounty. Wonderful. Okay, Catherine. I am not so confident. I guess I'll throw this out, even though I want it. Um, I can give you it's... an icon if you want. I don't want two damage, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm at, you... I'm at five right now. Okay, I'll give you one more agility. Sir. Okay. It's against three. Six against three. Oh my goodness. Okay. okay. Guess I shouldn't have thrown that thing. All right. It's pretty lucky. <laughs> and I get. Uh, and you get, to, you get to move to a connecting location. Oh, and I will absolutely move here. Nice. Yeah, I will say that's perfect. <laughs> Blood on your hands. Terror. Test two will. Increase the difficulty by one for each innocent enemy in the victory display. There are none. Uh, ah, yeah. so there's I was wondering a, a consequence. <laughs> yeah. I was wondering what the downside for killing these innocent guests were. Okay. <laughs> uh, that is a pass, because I am a five currently. Nice. Okay. Who wants to go first? Right. I'm going to be investigating. And then what am I going to do? Well, you can get a lead. Oh, yeah, I'll be doing that. Okay. Yeah, or I can get a lead. I have nothing to do. I can use my actions on right now. <laughs> Eight versus oh, that's two. True. Wait, you have three right. clues, Catherine? Yeah, maybe I shouldn't be getting two more. Should I? Um, I, I, I don't like know. It. Probably, we probably, probably will need more. I yeah. don't uh, need to exhaust the hotel guests, do I? Instead? No, I'll, I'll talk to her. Okay. All right. So that's my first action. Then I'm going to take two... What just happened? Okay. I'm going to take three, rather, and grab a lead. Um, wait a second. Let me think about this. Do we want to... What have we done in the room? Oh, and nothing. Only, oh, wait. Only no, no, no. Hit the, we hit the body. We hit the body. Yep. Ah, that's a We've long shot. The... Cleaning up the blood I can do, but I'm only up by two. Yeah. That's a long shot. I'm I'm not going to be able to be up by more than one for tidying up the room. Okay. No, no, that's fine. Just wanted to throw. It didn't work out so well. It's okay. So yeah. you're drawing a lead, okay. 
sinister solution. That's it. The flask is ice cold and the sickly green liquid within has the consistency of syrup. It smells vaguely of fish and ozone. Hanging from the top of the flask is a tag stamped. Test one. It is lead and science traded. <laughs> I love that science trade. Uh, so we immediately nope. advance. Oh, do we? Oh, yeah. We have two leads. Go ahead, Catherine. It isn't much, but it's all you've got. Your only real option now is to explore the rest of the hotel and see what you can learn. Put each of the set aside locations into play. Remove all the other leads from the game. All right, and depending on which leads are in play, we're gonna shuffle the following cards into the encounter deck, along with the encounter discard pile. Oh, interesting. All right, because manager's key is in play, we're gonna shuffle three copies of hotel security. Awesome. I think I can And it. if Sinister Solution is in play, we're gonna shuffle three copies of Morbid Awareness. Done. Okay. Uh so and then we got a bunch of locations to put into play. It's been a while. It's all the normal locations, right? Yeah. It just said all the lo all the remaining locations. So the basement room two four five from two. Or no, put us put aside the set aside locations into play. Yeah, maybe I should read the setup. Uh, <laughs> it just says each other location aside out of play, so that would be. Everything is in play. Okay, so the hotel roof is connected to the square. It'll be up here. Okay. We've got this is also connected to the square. I guess basement's connected down here somewhere. Oh yeah, okay. Okay, yep. And then these guys, room two, okay, this is also connected to the square. And then the office is connected to, looks like both the basement and the foyer. Yeah. Yep. All right, that makes sense. Kind of. Where's my? <clears throat> it would take me, yeah. It always takes me a really long time to check this over. <laughs> Somehow, I don't have the eye for quickly making sense of these. But I think yeah, this is I all right. I think we're good. Yeah. Maybe Seems good. Double check if there aren't any other locations in play. I don't see it. All right. So that was okay. that was the act. Okay, Act Two B. Okay. Following leads. Thanks to the leads you discovered in the suite, you're fairly sure whoever framed you is still in the hotel. The only Ooh. real question is where to find this person. Looking at the leads you found, you feel like the answers are right in front of you. Objective, learn more about your leads by placing clues on them, using abilities on some locations. The more clues, the better. At the end of the round, you may choose to advance if each lead asset has at least three clues on it. Hint, if you wish to present this evidence to the police, you may wish to have at least <laughs> six clues on each instead. Nice. <laughs> Got it. So it, it, we can't put any until we find these, the locations where it matters. So I'm just going to assume that I need the manager's key to go into the office. Yep. Yep. Okay. Ah, it does say that. You cannot enter the office unless you control the manager's key. Cool. So I guess you're unlocking that yep. location. 
Um, hmm. I do not know who is going to pick that lock at room 212. It would be very miraculous if I could do it. And that's it, I guess. Okay. I have one more action. I could investigate again. I guess I should. Just straight up. I got it. Nice. And I can exhaust. I might as well exhaust the enemy here. All right. That is me. Didn't you oh, I can only do that once per game. You're right. Yeah. I can only do that once per round. Okay. okay. Whoop. Whoop. There we go. That's okay. I will make a move. I'm going to pitch perception to this test to parlay. Plus one. That's okay. I wanted the card draw. Okay, that's good. Those your discard. Okay, so what happens to her? She's discarded. Discarded. Uh, looks like I want some field work next time, so I'm just going to move down for my last action. Ah, uh, on your way to the office. On my way to the office. Uh, okay. Well, I guess I'm, let's see, I'm going to put out my lucky cigarette case. Oh. Um, let's see. What are the bad effects here? The tokens. Doesn't really look like there's anything terrible right now. No. So I could just, I could just try and go for tests here if we want. I don't even remember what the test, what they even do. How's that? Yeah. Yep, that's fair. Um, I really have nowhere to be. Nothing to do. Um, so I guess I, you know, I, I am. I'm just going to try and tidy up the room. I'm even. I might be able to get something done. Okay. Okay, nope. And that was me. Well, very, very dirty. <laughs> Your last turn was rocking, so you get a you get a break. <laughs> okay, no enemies, so we can upkeep. I've got some stuff to use with Chuck now, so. Cool. Waiting. <laughs> Uh, that works for me. Okay. Uh, oh, we advance. Oh, now here's where <laughs> ben. that matters yep. with your room, eh? Oh boy, there's a lot I was trying to get something, but oh well. As you retrace your steps to make sense of the situation, there's a pounding on the door to the suite. This is the police, a stern voice calls out. We've got reports, reports of a disturbance. Open up. To set aside Sergeant Monroe into play in the foyer. Okay. <laughs> Spawn on one set aside Arkham officer and me at the second floor hall. Yay! Uh, there's three, there's spawn another set aside Arkham officer and me at the foyer. Okay, so there's Sergeant Monroe and an Arkham officer at the foyer. Uh, then shuffle each other set aside Arkham officer and me into the encounter deck along with the discard pile. Did that. Oh well. Lead, lead investigator draws the set aside. What have you done? Weakness. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. So this guy goes Into the foyer. here. Doesn't one of these guys in the foyer? One of these in the hall. Yep. With me, or is he aloof? Let's see. He is. And one one's gonna go to the foyer, and the other one's gonna get shuffled in. <clears throat> Guess I'm gonna put them here. All 
All right. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so I draw this weakness. What does it do? Revelation, put what have you done into the play in your threat area. As an additional cost for you to parlay, you must discard a card at random from your hand. Action, shuffle, what have you done into your deck? Eh, needs to parlay. That's not for me. All right, more stuff. Yep. Yeah. Uh, well, for each... Let's look at... This. Oh, go ahead. I was for each of the following circumstances, which is true, place one clue on room 225. And place one doom on an Arkham officer. Um, investigators have not cleaned up the blood. That is true. We place a clue on room 225 and a doom on an Arkham officer. So, two clues in your room? And uh, either... Yeah. In the end, there'll be two clues in the room and... You can either do doom. one doom on each or two doom... I say pile it up because I. Yeah, 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 for sure. Because it says now at the end of uh, the enemy phase, each clue. Oh, no, it's going from its location. Never mind. Maybe they should be split up. I guess it depends on how much you want to parlay. I mean, I don't mind. Whoever. It's another way of getting clues, right? Yeah. So, I mean, if you want two on one of yours, I mean, you could put two on one of yours or something. I don't know. I don't mind putting it on mine. Since I can probably do the test. Also, I'm getting the clues here. Trish might even want the clues, so let's see. Ah, ah. I get the doom. Okay. okay, so these guys patrol to the nearest location with clues. Oh, okay. Which is going to be room 225. Uh, uh, yep. Or down here. Oh, yeah, I guess they could all move to the foyer. Yeah. But that's not what we want, right? Uh, well, do you want to... Oh, what does Monroe do? Yeah, we're going to have to get rid of him eventually. Oh, no, they're innocents. He may oh, be no. assigned damage and or horror dealt to any investigator at his location, even if he is uncontrolled. Hey. Uh, when he's dealt any amount of damage or horror, exhaust him. Deal that much damage to a non-innocent enemy at his location. Any investigator may trigger this ability. I'm going to stay oh. here for a little while. I love it. Two days until retirement. <laughs> <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> That's nice. Okay. All okay. right. And Ben, you've got a new agenda to read. Uh, yeah. Okay. So agenda two, special investigation. You are not the only ones interested in the strange events at the Excelsior t tonight, and the police are on to you. You're still not sure what happened or if it could happen again. Uh, forced after an investigator at the same location as a ready police enemy discovers one or more clues at that location or deals damage to a humanoid enemy, each ready police enemy at that location engages that investigator and makes an immediate attack. Yeah. Okay. Oof. Okay, so Trish, don't come here and get clues. Well, after, right? So... Let me look at my ability more close, closely here. Yeah. Uh, also a... after. Oh, yeah. yeah. And, and that's a forced on the agenda, so. So that happens come... before the reaction. Okay. Yeah. All right. Darn. <laughs> okay, draw your bad cards. Okay. Blood on your hands. Test willpower two. We have zero... Uh, enemies, innocent enemies in the victory display, right? Yeah. Yep. And I'm going to commit nothing. I failed. So I take two horror. Yeah. All right, Ben. I've also got blood on my hands, probably from all those bodies I'm trying to hide. <laughs> <laughs> that is no surprise. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, okay. I guess I'm just, well, I guess. I'll take this one. 
Really? Uh, it's up to you. I'm up by three. Would you mind taking it? No, I'll take it. And that way, if you fail, you don't have to discard a card from your hand. True. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Uh, yeah, well, you handle this one. <laughs> okay, and you'll get money for it. Yep. I, I pass. My card, Morbid Awareness. Test 6 Mind. Reduce the difficulty of this test by 1 for each location away from room 212 you are. Uh, hey, Catherine. Yes? You need to go to room 212. <laughs> I, I really don't think I can get in. Okay. But okay, I if, will. I, I mean, it might take the whole game for me to unlock it. <laughs> if you fail, you must either place one of your clues on your location or take two horror. Okay, where is room 212? I am two locations locked. away, so it's a four. Uh, it's locked. You cannot enter from the second floor. Really? That's the only way in? Apparently, yeah. Kind of brutal. No, there's got to be another way. Perhaps, maybe. I mean, I'm even with it, you know? It's not, like, impossible, but I have no... I have very few evade boosts. Like, I just... That's not how I decided to evade enemies, you All know? Right. Well, I passed. Okay. So, that's us. That's us. Okay. Oh, okay. Should I at this point have three clues? That seems like too many. Uh, you would have spent all three. Oh. No, wait. Yes, you spent I... all three. One, yeah. two, I thought four, I did. Three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, this this got two clues placed on it two, again. This three. Was yeah, I had right. three. I got six. And I spent maybe two clues. Yeah. Oh, I know I had I had seven total. Yeah. Um, oh yes, then we're right. Yeah, yeah, I did get seven total because okay. I had two, and we we had nine. Now we have three, having spent on two leads. All right. All right. So. I guess, let me see, um, let me do this. I'll go first, if that's okay. Uh, sure. Um, before I do his action, I'm going to try and pick the lock. That's a big fail. Okay, but nothing bad happens. I kind of don't want to find my weakness. So I will search the top six. Oh, you might find it anyway. Yeah. <laughs> or not. No, I didn't. So that's good. Okay. Oh, the smart thing to do would be to take this. So I guess that's what I'll do. Okay. Even though, I mean, that's going to my hand. But okay. Um, That's my turn. Oh, wait, no, I still have one more action, don't I? And you still get to shuffle those back in your deck. I am, it's just going to take me a while, so right. I just wanted you guys to go. <laughs> <laughs> if it was the end of my turn, because that Good takes trick. a while. Good trick, by the way, flipping that card. That is not my idea. I borrowed that from <laughs> someone. But there we go. I use this. And I will test again. So I'm at six versus, what is the test? Four? Four. Hey. Minus two. How many guest enemies are in play? Oh, guess? None. Zero. Yeah. Yep, okay, zero. so I All picked right. the lock. And you get to immediately move to it. All right. 
what's in the room. Oh Ooh. my gosh. Holy a God. lot of clues. Um, and victory. Okay. And victory. All right. Oh. A mass of inhuman matter sits in a glass tub on the desk, connected to all manner of strange and futuristic lab equipment. The bed nearby looks like it was never slept in. Sitting on the mattress is a case of vials, each filled with green, viscous liquid. Science. All right. I have to test book three to move any number of clues controlled by investigators at this location to a sinister solution. This will take a while. That's okay. That is well, okay. So in a single test, you can move a bunch. Yeah. Okay. Uh, that is my turn. What was your first action? Was getting Rook out? I played Mr. Rook. Got it. And I tried just t testing the lock pick by itself, and then pulled a card All right. and tested it again. Yeah, I'm done. Tony. Uh, okay. What should I do? <laughs> you cannot parlay, right? I cannot parlay. Right you don't now. want to parlay, anyways, right? No, no, I don't. <laughs> I have no interest. Nor am I very good at it. <laughs> well, um, I can move around. <clears throat> Are you going to parlay, Luke, this uh, Arkham officer? Uh, that's my plan. I hope so. Okay. Parlay, 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 move is my is my play. So, but this, so the, uh, Tony, the officer, I mean, ben, you know, the officer is about to come in there and start getting doom on him. He can go down though. He could, but why would we want that? Don't we just want to kill him? Uh, if we're going to kill him, then we should just kill him. Let's not. I mean, kill... Tony's looking for people to kill, right? Yeah. <laughs> uh, he is an innocent though. Um, I don't know if we want to. Yeah, it's going to buff up blood on our hands that and the tokens there's the... yeah well i mean there's there's no way to get them unless somebody like dedicates to evading and parlaying right they're going to be racking up a lot of doom yeah that is true which i feel like we got to kill one of them i feel like we have to i don't know <laughs> it's just, there's two of them there's their they're big problems, but uh, <laughs> it's binary. It's if there's an innocent enemy in the victor display, yes or no. Ah, uh, <laughs> okay. Uh, because of this, because of this, well done, MJ. No, well done, Nick. Right? This wasn't this yeah, no, well Nick. done, Nick. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, Nick. Ah, okay, Ben. Why don't I go first? Sure. And then I maybe the office will have something in it. Uh, for now, I will just parlay a couple times. I'm pretty certain the office will have something. <laughs> I get one clue off him. And I get a second clue off him and a charge on my gate box. Okay, Chaos Bag, we're friends again. I mean, it has been very kind to us, this game. Not to me. <laughs> Overall. I lost my Overall, we've had, we've each gotten Elder Signs and I think yeah. Ben's drawn multiple Elder Signs. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so I believe I can just walk in there, right? Yep, since you have the manager's key. Mm -hmm. Test is zero book. For each point you succeed by, you move one clue controlled by an investigator oh. to the, in the office to the manager's key if it is in play. Hey, what do you know? Yeah. The manager of the Excelsior is obviously a busy person. Newspaper clippings, strange documents, and keys of all sorts are scattered about. Well, it's going to take me a while to dig through these clues, but... Uh, and I'm going to have... You need to get six, right? Hopefully. Oh! And, uh... Wait a second. Oh, and now the officer is going to come to our location. Yes. And that's not good. Because I don't, they'll attack me, right? 
they'll engage in attack. So if you, unless they're. But then I, but you know, I, uh, yeah, it's not the worst thing in the world. I guess for you. Oh, it's not. They, you know what? But the, he's going to be. Whether or not he's ready, he takes that clue and turns it into doom. That stinks. But then, yeah, and I'm not going to be able to pass that parlay test. Ooh. Whereas you might, like, you can just. Yeah, yeah I mean, well, the, now kick, you can... the kicker is, is that you can get additional clues while he's there. And I can't get any clues while he's there, only by getting them off him. Uh, yeah. So this is going to slow me down a you, lot. You want him to get four. And then parlay, 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 right? And then you'll have six clues. <laughs> yeah, well, I want the victory. Well, I guess, yeah, you could, you have two. Okay. You know or what? rather, you have, you have one action left. Maybe no, you I could don't. get these. No? Oh. Okay. What I will do is I will try to exhaust him. Because you can parlay to exhaust. That's how I do it. Before you move? Uh, oh, you mean when, no, once he once enters your location? Once okay. Because it's when does that happen? At the beginning, what's par what's patrol again? At the beginning of the enemy phase? Right. Yeah. 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 It's like a hunter. Okay. I'm okay with that. It's it's just as easy for me to grab a clue off the officer as it is to grab a clue off the office. Which right now this one won't move since there is clues on his location. Oh. Uh, but he patrols to the nearest location with clues. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, Ooh. nearest location. Oh, you're... Okay, yeah. You're right, you're right. So this one's definitely moving so he to can room move, 212. Yeah. He can move down. This one, he can move down. He can move over to room 225. He can move down. It's probably the best. Yeah. Thing. Why don't we do that? Because then, Trish, you can be all speedy, and then we'll hold the fort. How does that sound? All right, I can I can try to be speedy. Uh, uh, works better if there's a person there, but I don't know how to really make that happen. If as soon as I get any clues, he attacks me. <laughs> yeah. Um, unless he unless you're able to exhaust him every well, turn, I know that's a two fleetness. Let me think about it. Let me think about him. Let me think about him for a second. So he, I don't have a ton of money i don't have any money never mind uh so i was thinking okay so i get two clues he he moves into my location right then at the beginning of my turn i get two clues he attacks me then i was thinking okay well i can play working a hunch and like get two clues and then if I had more money, I could play two, you know what I mean? I could play right. that. I have two of them in my hand. I could get six clues and only take one attack from him, um, which might be worth it for a while, right? <laughs> um, but I don't have the money to do that. So I guess, yeah, I, it's, yeah. All right, maybe, and who knows, maybe okay. I will get, draw an enemy, I have no idea. You can get at least three clues from that location, right? fairly easily it'll take three turns probably to get three clues i mean because yeah. i can yeah i can jump into my gate box and just draw into the flame from there okay to speed it along okay and i like that play it's safe because then if i draw an enemy it, without a spawn keyword it just mm -hmm. whips Yeah, so, so I mean, Doom is going to go on this. Go, there, Doom is going to be on the officers, but we can I, I'll build get that one. up for a while, I'll, I'll and we'll get it back. That. Yeah. Yeah. So, meanwhile, Tony still has a whole turn to do. <laughs> yep. Does that yeah. make sense? <laughs> Clear as mud. <laughs> so we let the officers be. That's the consensus. Does that mean that we explore the rest of the hotel, or not? Like, does he move to the balcony just to see what he can see, or is probably a waste of his time? Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. I don't really know. Yeah, I don't know uh, either. It might just be, like, more clues or something, and then, you know, you'll just have to move back. 
sadly. <laughs> you could just draw cards, I suppose. Almost what I'm thinking. <laughs> uh... Oh, hang on. I moved into this location. I should be able to draw from my map, right? I haven't done that yet. Oh, yeah, right. do that. Yep. Nope, but the good news is Detached from Reality has been in my top three every time. And I just get to reshuffle it back. Oh, uh, yeah. now this map would be really cool to use that. Oh, no, not Detached from Reality. Sorry, I thought you meant Deciphered Reality. Oh, yeah, that would be... Yeah, I was like, that would be really cool. <laughs> I'll move one to centralize myself. That's good. You don't want to be at a crime scene right now. Oh, yeah. yeah. Right. Yep. I can finally leave that room. Blend uh, in. <laughs> I'll draw a card. Ooh. Drawn as my last action. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> nice. That's fine. All right. Okay. Well, I've got a lot, lots of fighting options now. <laughs> now stuff happens. So if they're already at a location with clues, do they patrol? I mean, the nearest can be zero locations away, right? Definition yeah, the they're going to get those. And now that it's empty, they're going to move. Uh, some enemies, that, okay, during the enemy phase, each ready unengaged enemy with patrol keyword moves to a connecting location along the shortest path toward the designated location. I think he has to move. Um, he moves to the nearest location, which could be his own location, right? Okay, I guess so. It says moves to a connecting location. That's why I... Oh, it does say that. Okay. Um, I mean, it wouldn't change too much if we just left that clue there for next time. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. But then that means he would then move back away. That might be good, right? Yeah. It gives you a little hmm. more time. And then the other one goes to the restaurant. Or could go to the restaurant, right? Yeah. But yeah. Interesting. Okay. Well, that's uh, time for upkeep. All right. Nice. Thanks. Let's uh, put one Doom down. That's three of 12. Bad cards. Well, we are, you're right. Yeah, okay. Hotel guest. Nearest hall. Nearest, nearest hall. That's where I am. That's correct. I cannot parlay. <laughs> that is what just happened there. And she goes to the nearest crime scene location? Yep. All right. What do you got, Ben? Oh, okay. I've got... There he is. Uh, Arkham officer. He's oh, no. Is it time for some innocents to die? <laughs> <laughs> if you're going to kill him, put a bounty out. <laughs> Oh, that's true. We'd have to make that decision now. Uh, I mean, a team of mystics would love this scenario. I was going to say, I, I am not set up to help at all with any of these parlays. So, like, I'm going to be no good <laughs> trying to keep up with all that. Yeah. Um. Oh, oh, 212 is a crime scene. Yes, it is. Oh. I like that. 
So she'll still get a doom. She'll still get a doom. But, you know, I could, you could eventually at least get a couple her. clues and then parlay her away. Yes. So. Yes, you can. Yeah. Okay. Um. And I've got conspicuous staff. Nearest crime scene location. Hey. That... You have... I could, I could put it there. I could put it uh, in room they're 225. In, oh, they're equidistant for you? Yeah. It um, won't matter. Put it either. Why? Because Tony's going to go after it. <laughs> yeah, I can call them over to me. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Uh, do so you want me to leave it with you, Trish, just in case you have a trick? Or throw it elsewhere? Sure. Yeah. I'm putting a bounty on that one. Alright. <laughs> putting a bounty on that staff. Alright. Just looking at Mr. Rook here. Hmm. Yeah, of course. Well, <laughs> it's all right. Whatever. Well, I mean, I can always take it from you too if you want need me to. No, it's it's fine. He was just saying he doesn't have anything to do. <laughs> I literally, yeah. Uh... Now he's got stuff to do. Oh, I hate it all. Yeah, it's fine. Hey, maybe that's what that token remover is for. There's a token? Yeah, I'm going yeah, to try it. Oops. I'm locking up. I don't know exactly how it works. I read the description at some point. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, so all I have to do is evade it and it's I, it, it just get it gets discarded. I but, can, um, I can kill it. I can kill it. Tony can probably kill it. Okay. Yeah. So why don't yeah? All right. Tony, why don't you go first? I'll be your backup. All right. Um. Let's see. I was originally going to go after the staff, but should I go after the shadow agents? Uh, okay. If this works, I can kill the shadow agents in one go. Okay. I uh, I prefer to get rid of the staff since I don't really think the shadow agents are too much trouble. But all right. Uh, I mean, hey, I way. prefer you got rid of both. But if in a pinch, okay, I can get, I can get <laughs> yeah. rid of the other one. Yeah. Let, let's see. I'm going to use. Shuck. All right, to make this both pass. Um, <laughs> you engage and you fight, and it's free. Yeah. So, yep, it's fast, and I'm going to get plus two to my skill value. That's awesome. So I take it over to me, and I get to fight it. All right, so I'm at, plus, I'm at seven to its three. Um, yeah, because it's just a regular attack. Oh! Okay. Oh. I'm Whatever. still the auto fail cool. magnet. <laughs> Alright. Well, I'll use my switchblade for this my first attack now. Uh, seven against three. Yeah, now you do it. Well. Yeah, okay. I mean, you would have had to do it anyways, right? Yeah, that I would have only done one damage on that first one, so I would have had to attack anyways. Um, but I, I at least like got moved and you know engaged for free, so that was nice. 
Uh, okay, so I still have three actions now. Oh yeah, go ahead, because I can always use my actions to draw into the flame instead of Spectral Razor. I could move up there. Oh, forgot to use my lucky cigarette case. My last attack. I had a plus one, so I was at eight to three, so five cards. Upgraded? Oh, oh yeah. Upgraded yep. sink case. <laughs> okay. More weapons. Okay, so let's see, what can I do? If I move up, I can grab the shadow agents. I don't know if that really helps anyone. I um, mean, you know, yes, I mean, you know, of course it would. I, I probably because you just can't uh, investigate when it's engaged with you, right? Okay. I mean, I would take the hit of opportunity. I can investigate. Um, it just says I can't oh, yeah. except by investigating. Gotcha. The, yep. No, no special, no special tricks. Like I have to take the hit. That's all. <laughs> oh, I suppose. I mean, I could come up, engage it, and then when you discovered a clue, you could auto evade it, which would mm -hmm. discard it. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. That seems like a, a worthwhile use of my time, I guess, because I'm not going anywhere else. Uh, so I will move up. Let's see. Do I want to do anything before I engage? This will draw a card. Okay. And I'll engage. Ooh. There we go. All right. Thank you. Go ahead, Catherine. Okay. So. Eight versus four. I don't want to fail. And I feel like I keep hoping followed works, but like maybe it's just better in solo. Like I'm, I, there's no enemies like that sit around with damage on them, you know? So I'm at nine versus four. All right, that was, I don't even know if there's like a minus five equivalent in the bag. There probably isn't. Um, you know, something, okay. yeah, no. Oh, well, that was pointless, I guess. At any rate. Um, I guess there was, clues? I'm not going to get two clues. I'm going to take one and evade and discard the shadow agents, which is what I had thought we had talked about. Right, Ben? Uh, but no, but you get two uh, from followed. Followed gives you an extra, right? Followed does give me an extra clue. Um, but I never have made it work is what I'm saying. It's, you get like plus one, um, for each damage on the enemy. Oh, I guess it doesn't. Yeah, it's plus one book, and if you if just flat out if you succeed. Okay, discard. sorry, I was discarding that as a icon, so that's oh, that. Oh, okay. Yeah, oh. that's. I just put it up there. I don't have enough resources to pay for that, and um, yeah. Got it. I, I that was what I was saying was pointless. Like I didn't need to even discard it, um, because there was I was up by four, <laughs> yeah. I guess. So I just got paranoid that I was gonna fail so um well grab the clue yeah and there's your shadow agents there we go and i'm going to oh I mean, you know what i should have done this i should have done this first now that i wasn't engaged i absolutely I'm gonna take back everything that I just did <laughs> because oh, this is okay, that kind of game, game, right? Yeah. 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 Whoops. Hold on. Those listening at home, we play fast to get the stream done, <laughs> right? so not to sit here forever. So if something happens, so it's here's what I'm gonna do. Just take it. 
I'm playing followed and I'm getting two clues. And that's just what happened. And you don't know any different. How much does followed cost? Sounds good. Two. Okay. Yeah. I've got it. Yeah. And with my last action, um, did I really use Rook this turn? You did. That's how I did. I did. I did. Um, I guess. Oh gosh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I know. Don't want to. Don't want to use working a hunch yet, right? If want to save it. But obfuscation is basically the same thing, right? Cancel. <laughs> but they're never engaged. I don't know. I was looking at in the no. That's so good. In the no is really good too. I know. I you know what? Let's try that. Right? Yeah. Well we yeah. can swap because there won't be anyone at my location next turn. You could totally in the know it. All right. We, I mean, we want the victory point from both of them, but yeah, I am done. All right. So first thing I'm going to do is the test parlay. What is this? Minus one. Ha! There is no innocent enemy in the victory display. So I will yeah. just... Duh! <laughs> so I will parlay that off him. I then want to run into the happy place. <laughs> Whee! Uh, and I will draw into the flame targeting room 212. So I draw the top card of the encounter deck. That's not an enemy. Uh, but it's blood on your hands. That's, that's so good. Except this assumes I'm on... I'm in a crime scene for the purpose of this treachery. Is that correct? Uh, the way Luke works right is that you play the event as if you are at yeah, so that, yeah. includes that location. Everything surrounding the event to make it easy for everybody, I believe. Yeah, that makes sense. Well, I got it. I wasn't going to fail that one. So I grab two clues. Oh, yeah. you know what? I... Uh, I jumped into a location. Are you kidding me? <laughs> no map, huh? No map. <laughs> uh, right. So I'm going to put out some field work for my last action. That's me. Okay. Is that all of us? That's all of us. That was. All right. Now, so patrolling, now I suppose. I get to jump back anywhere I please. Yes. I think. Am I going to be on Doom Patrol? For... Yeah, I'm going to be on Doom Patrol first. Okay. Ooh, this is only if you have clues. Okay, so I'm going to go here. Okay. I mean, I think the hotel guest could go to us or 225, but I think it makes sense for her to come yeah. to where I am. Yeah, yeah that makes sense. I would like to swap their places. Presuming that's how it works, yeah. <laughs> it's like... Just because this will put me, I won't have to dart around the map so much. And this guy's got to move. Yeah. There's, yeah. He's either going to 225 or 212. Yeah. So. Um, oh, you know what? You were. I'm planning on discarding the hotel guest. Right. Um, so you're probably getting the two clues from your location this turn, right? Yes. Okay. 
then I'll set it up yeah. this way. So I'm, I'm trying to move the officers away from this on the same turn that you could possibly in the know. And I'm assuming you're going to grab your two clues this turn and save your in the know for later. In which case, one. I think so. I yeah. think I will do that and then try to parlay the guess. And I don't, yeah, because I don't want to, I can only use my thing once. Yeah, um, that's perfect because then I have it set up. So next turn, they'll both move left. Okay. Well. Hmm. No. Yeah, I suppose like, you're saying they need to move. Yeah. And, oh, yeah. 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 We could choose the order. So, yeah. Uh, okay. So we still need to figure out this other Arkham officer. Right. So he's oh, yeah. Not, he's not going to the restaurant. Then he either has to go to room 225. Now, left. if I get those clues this turn, then he attacks me. Um, he's which is probably one don't clue. Yeah, we probably don't want him going to us then. Okay. Uh, then he goes. Yeah. We'll deal with him later, I guess. Yep. Yeah. Because I cannot parlay him. Not really. Not at all. <laughs> he definitely not. Yeah, we just have to be extra yeah. speedy about this. That's all. Upkeep? Okay. Oh, uh, yeah. Upkeep. Oh, cool. Wish I had more than one of these in my deck. Oh. Unfortunately, I don't have the actions for that right now. Nice. Okay, we are now at like, five doom? Six doom. Six. Yes, yeah, it is adding up. A uh, conspicuous staff. It spawns here. E. The bounty on them. Okay. These staff. Yeah. All right. I'm drawing blood on your hands. Okay. Well, I am at a crime scene again. Shoot. No, oh, you can send it to me again if you want. Uh, yeah, sure. I'll do that. There. You have blood on your hands. <laughs> uh, you bet. That's okay. I can take the horror. It's totally fine. Violent Outburst. Ooh. There is a humanoid enemy. Uh, otherwise, the nearest humanoid enemy readies, moves one location at a time until it reaches your location, engages you, and makes an immediate attack. Yikes. I have been punched. <laughs> Cool. <clears throat> All right. That's going to slow me down a bit. Well, are you going to try it and like parlay for an evade there? Yeah. All right. Oops, I'm flipped. Yep. Oh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Oh, we double flipped. Yeah. Uh, okay. Let me see what I can find. My last. Okay. While you're doing that, what the um, heck? I'll go first this time. If it's all right. I will parlay I'm... this dude. Yeah. Nope. That didn't happen. Oh, you know what? Come on. Now. Hang on. Um, Sergeant Monroe actually took this damage in the horror for me. Yeah, he did. Uh, I am going to move, which is going to give me an attack of opportunity and damage our poor sergeant again. I can exhaust field work, and let's do this again. There we go. Minus one. So this guy is exhausted. That's my turn.
Okay. Yeah, so forget about that in the no plan. Okay. I'm in total uh, parlay mode here. All right. Uh, my plan, anyway, was this turn to... Oh, did the bounty disappear? Uh, I took it back because I realized I don't... I, I don't want to put a bounty on it. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Just, uh, <clears throat> I go before you, I can just destroy them. Okay. Yep. Take your turn. That's fine. All um, right. Uh, Chuck will exhaust. Put out a sneak attack. For fast and free. Kill two damage to an enemy not engaged with you. Uh, there we go. Conspicuous staff is gone. <laughs> <laughs> cool. <laughs> <laughs> Tony is fast. That's yeah. Yeah. Oh, Chuck. Uh, okay. So, let's see. Well, I'm not gonna be able to gain clues here, so maybe I should start running down somewhere else. Yeah. Um. What What are we thinking about these officers? We still just trying to juggle the the doom. Yeah, it's starting to get a little overwhelming. I'm still going to do what I can. We still have time. But I, I wouldn't mind if you were down here. Okay. Yeah, after I get these two clues, I have to start actually piling. Not start, I guess I have to do one massive test yeah. to put them all on the solution. Yeah. Okay. I can do that. Oh, and when uh, hotel guest, this hotel guest patrol blast round, right? They should have gotten a doom. It's another at a right. I crime guess, scene location. I guess so. Yeah. That's correct. If that's yeah, the, ship, the patrol happens at the beginning. Then yeah. Yes. And I moved down to the foyer. I mean, I could go all the way over to your location if we need me there. Let's see. Yeah, because I could probably do that test. Yeah, because I can move one clue controlled by an investigator. Oh, yeah, that's right. Office. Like, I can still help you do that action. So you I will can. just move in. I'll move in as my last action. I should hopefully be able to help with that a little bit. I've got three intellect, so. Any yeah, little it's bit not bad. I can also pitch yep. you cards to help. Yeah. All right, and that is me. Get Trish. Okay. Let me investigate. Eight against four should be good. Minus yes. One. How many guests? Just one. All Just right. the one in your room. I will take, yep, <laughs> these two clues. Peeking through the doorway here. <gasps> <laughs> I know. I love that art. <laughs> the 1920s gossip. <laughs> and then I'm going to crack the case. Two, oh, three, nice. four. And I'm just going to play this while I have the resources for it. Just pickpocket. So that's one action. I'm going to try and discard the hotel guest at this point. Yeah. I'm not going to pitch anything because I want to save my icons for the solution. So I'm only up by one. Oh, of course. Good thing you didn't pitch. Oh, one pattern at least. Yeah, as I said, what's the matter anyway? <sighs> Do I let her be for one turn or try one more? I think I have to. Two, three, four, five, six. I have a seven. pretty we'll poor still chance. Be okay. We'll still be okay. Yeah. All right. In that, turn. I'm going to just pitch these. So I'm at eight. And I have to test. Let me go back up here and double check. Okay. Intellect three. Oh my god! <laughs> okay. That was my glorious turn. I have accomplished nothing. 
<laughs> okay. Uh, you are now oh, yeah, the autofail auto magnet. Yeah, I thought that I really had that magic thinking where I was like, okay, I just pulled it. Now I can't pull it again. So therefore, now's the time. <laughs> yep. um, oh, man. Well, that's still something that someone else can do as well. Okay. I can hop down there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we can trade locations. You know what? It wasn't the time anyway, because I, I somehow only have four clues. I guess I thought I was at six. Oh. So. Well, if I get down there. I'll I'm have glad I failed. <laughs> I should have in the node, but no, I will wait till next term. I am done. That's everybody then. Okay. He readies. He moves. This stupid hotel guest gets another doom. Darn it. And he patrols. Oh, yeah, because he has to move? Okay. Yeah, up he. Uh, you, you don't want me to take any of those clues that you have on your location, right? Oh, you can. Just there's a guy there. There's a guy there, which means he would engage. He would engage you and make an immediate attack. How could he engage me? He just just does. <laughs> which is actually really As funny. <laughs> you would move him across the map. <laughs> I mean, it's one way to get rid of him. Because then he has to walk all the way back. <laughs> That's true. Uh, we could do that. I don't mind taking a damage. Actually, I've, I'm looking to, for something to kill Rook. <laughs> you know, that's all he's good for now is, is points. You know. Um, anyway, uh, did we upkeep? Uh, yeah, uh, it's time for upkeep. All right. Oh, oh man. Uh, we have Doom. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Guys, I might have to kill this hotel guest. <laughs> I'll get it. I'll get the hotel guest this turn. I just, I, I, I don't like all these innocent bystanders. They're making me nervous. <laughs> If we get rid of the hotel guest, we're okay. Okay. My turn? Yeah. Encounter? Violent outburst. Uh, does this hotel guest think she can attack me? <laughs> I guess so. Yeah. <laughs> you better get here fast. I am about to destroy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, Mr. Rook takes the damage. Did that gossipist just I punch Mr. You? Rook? <laughs> Morbid awareness. Test six willpower. I think you're taking uh, too difficulty. more. <laughs> Almost done. You reduce the difficulty by one for each location away from 212 you are. One, two, three. Three away. So it's a test of three willpower. Not horrible. There is a chance. Oh, I have no clues, so I have no way to darn. Um, let's see. Oh, I'm at two. Yeah, there's there's no chance. All right, I'm just taking two more. No, you're not. <laughs> you're passing. I told you there was a chance. There's always a chance. No, <laughs> not always. But that's how <laughs> it always. was. There was. Uh, wow. Okay, that is awesome. And we have a hotel guest at the nearest hall location. She's got a ways to go. Yeah, she'll be in the foyer. Yep, okay. Our turn. Hmm. Tony, you have nothing to do. <laughs> I give you permission. Yeah. I can I can Start. take yeah I can take care of the one with Trish I'll just parlay her away. 
but uh, given that you're just sitting there, I totally don't mind if you get rid of some cops. <laughs> All right. In the context of the game. And you need three clues from this location is what's going to happen, right? Hold up. You have... Okay, why, why don't I go first then just to clear it up. Okay. I'm going to jump into my gate box. And reappear here. Hi. <laughs> Hello. I am going to parlay. Minus one. Good thing I did that first. She's gone. Beautiful. I'm a sweet talker. Hey, baby, want to come to my... Want a wondrous journey oh, to my it's... special place? <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> I don't know where that oh, victor is display this? is. Oh, okay. that victor display. Yeah. We'll just put it back here. We should have... Two in the victory display, did we not? Oh no, no these just get discarded. Yeah, the parlay discards them. Oh, oh, okay. You're All right. right. We don't want them in the victory display. And uh, <clears throat> last action, I'm going to. What's that test? It's a three. Yeah, it's on, it's uh. Oh, we can put any as many clues as we have. Excellent. Yeah, so I'm just going to pitch working a hunch. Minus two, that's a pass. So uh, yeah. Oh, I was going to say, if you needed an icon, I have one, but okay. I'm good. So I'm going to ditch two of my clues. You can ditch your... I will get rid uh, of four. You know what? Oh, yeah, yeah. What? Yeah, for sure. No, yeah, no. yeah. It's, it's... It, it should be done well, that way. I'm because... getting rid of all of mine. Yeah, you should, because I have the key, which means I have to be at that location anyways. So I'm going to save yeah. that, as many clues as I can. Okay, so we should have six clues on your Sinister Solution. That's good. Well, cool. thank you. And that's my turn. All right. Now, I can get two clues off the office and then. Kill Rook. <laughs> try to move down to. Because I need to be there then to help you put them back on. The manager's yes. key, right? Yes, you do. Yeah. And we're also one clue short. Because I only have one clue. There's only four there. So we'll need... Well, I can, I can walk in, like, in the know, like, the restaurant or something. Or, I guess, oh, yeah. 225. Yeah. All right. As I walk. Okay. So let me investigate here. I'm investigating also with the... Oh, wait. No, that's fine. No, I can't. Oh, darn it. Oh that yeah, doesn't, that doesn't work with my lockpicks. <laughs> so I am investigating a four on a three. So I will pitch one, five on a three. Hey, Ooh. I can choose any revealed location. <laughs> well, <laughs> I don't want to choose a different one. So I will still take these. Because I'm, I'm not going to, I'm not going to exhaust the uh, Arkham officer. I don't want to do that. All right. And Mr. Rook dies. Man, poor Mr. Rook. Horribly. <laughs> All he did was send some shadow agents after you. <laughs> All right. Then I'm going to be on my way. I guess, right? Because I can't really. Well. I could try to evade him. Then I can do some pickpocketing, right? Or do I just put out obfuscate and start motoring? What would you say? Uh, either way, I'm going to be sitting here and parlaying him. So. So you don't want me to take him away. Oh, I see. That was my. I don't, I've only done one action. Uh, I do, it doesn't have to be him that I parlay. I can parlay anybody. I'll probably end up jumping back in the gate box, anyways. Oh, okay. 
Um, I feel like I should just move. So I'm going to block one. I think I'll try to evade him for fun. Hey, <laughs> okay. Well, that's going to be a juicy location. There'll be a hotel guest, an Arkham officer. And well, after Tony's done lighting up. To draw a card and a resource. All right. Nice. Done. Mr. Morgan. All right. Uh, hmm. So I guess if I have for sure that we want to start killing some of these officers. I mean, I'm definitely oblige. <laughs> We're so close to the end it feels like how much could it backfire <laughs> right? yeah i'm saving my spectral razors i, I assume there's more to the scenario after this right like, yeah oh, but yeah. like i'm saying that like we're we're what i mean is like we're going to eventually see that like how many more bad tokens are we going to draw right <laughs> It's inevitable. Hmm. We have to kill some innocents. Maybe not, though. Gotcha. Maybe, yeah, you know, if we've made it this far, maybe there's some sense in continuing to skirt around killing them. Well, they're oh. outpacing me. And if I'm the only one parlaying. Yeah. I do not yeah. have a good chance of that. We yeah. don't have high there's, will. <laughs> yeah, there's only one of us that can really parlay. <laughs> yeah, and on the other hand, we got somebody who's really good at shooting people and yeah. killing them. So. <laughs> when there were two, it was fine, but... That would be a crying shame if he didn't try it. All right, all right. Yes. I've got my eyes on this two-doom arc. I'll be right back. Okay. Um, I wouldn't be sad. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, I'll move. I will engage. Then I will attack with my switchblade and commit a vicious blow. It's an eight by my count. Yep. Eight to three. Wow. Oh. Oh. Well, uh, Catherine is still the autofail magnet. <laughs> nope, nobody is. Nobody is. Took a while to kick in. Well, I can still, with Chuck, use for fast. Just clean them out so I can try and do one damage to them. Uh, two resources. Fast, and I get plus two to the value, so seven against three. All right, so I do one damage. Does that token look weird yeah. to you? Yeah, it's still like not loading. There we go. Okay. Yeah. Just took a while to load. Well, oh. That was unfortunate. Sorry, oh. I went to my dream gate again, didn't I? Oh, it was number 10. Oh, well. <laughs> so that is everybody. So, movement. Yep. The hotel guest moves up. This one readies. This guy moves to the nearest location with clues, which could be the scene or could be here. Yeah. I guess the restaurant, because then they're farther away from any other clues. Oh, yeah, I guess. Sure. That's okay. Keep them away from the yeah. crime scene. Yeah. That makes sense. Oops. Yeah. Uh, and now it's upkeep. Oh, I like seeing that. Uh, mine 
deals me one damage, which I'll just put on Chuck. Hey. I got a mob enforcer. Hey, you might be parlaying this game. I yeah, I will be. I'm not gonna put a bounty on him, because I'm just gonna parlay him. Okay. Okay. I guess uh, we're still waiting for Catherine. So why don't you? Yep. Oh, I'll doom up. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, ben, why don't you yeah. just go ahead and draw your card, your encounter card? Uh, sure. Oh, the madness. Interesting. Uh, attach to the madness the nearest human enemy. Attach enemy gets plus one fight. Plus one power, plus one trade. Hi, sorry, sorry, sorry. Attach enemy loses aloof. Investigators cannot parlay with attached enemy. All right. Well, I guess I'm just putting it on my cop. He's yeah. Four health. Well. So Chuck Fergus uh, drew the auto fail on a vicious blow. So nobody is the auto fail magnet anymore. Oh no. Uh, I have hotel security spawn nearest empty location. Hunter retaliate if it's. Did you guys draw for me? Uh, not yet. You'll be you'll be drawing oh, last. Okay. Nearest empty. I guess that would be this one. If there's at least one guest enemy in play, hotel security loses hunter and gains patrol. Hmm. Nearest location with a guest enemy. The second floor hall. Uh, is not empty. Oh. Oh, I thought you said... Oh, I see. They're patrolling the nearest location, I guess. Yeah. In fact, why don't we just put them here? Are you still looking for your map, by chance? Oh, you bet. Yeah. Yeah, you, you, <laughs> yeah that thing is very deep. Um... Which is fine. I mean, Wit and Green is her own reward. That gate box is a relic, so oof. she has saved me. All right, I have driven, or I have driven to madness, which is not great. Um, okay, I attach this to the nearest humanoid enemy. Plus one fight, plus one health, plus one evade. He loses aloof. No one can parlay with him. Ooh. Uh, but after he's evaded, this gets discarded. So is it the... we can pick it on the officer or the guest. What do you guys reckon? They're both bad. Is what I reckon. Mm, okay. <laughs> so <laughs> we have yeah, a choice. I think I, can I get this underneath? I don't even know. No, we'll you put it can. here. We know. Okay. Yeah. There is a way to do it. Let's see. We know. Let's see. Ah! I just have to stop touching things. It, sna it snaps too, you know? <laughs> you can't really. Yeah. There's a. Let me see. I'm going to try it. I know. Oh, I may not have. Um, oh, I see. Yeah. Promotion. You have to be, prom be promoted. Oh. Yeah. Done. There's a way to like stick, stick objects to each other. You are both promoted. <laughs> Thank you. Have murders happened? When you left? Yeah. Uh, no, we he tried to murder. <laughs> oh, it was just the auto fail. I see. Yeah. Okay. So we're still stainless. We are don't still stainless on our hands. So <laughs> let's see. This is this is not uh, <laughs> working. I guess. Oh well. Keeps. Anyways. Yeah, yeah. Anyway. So loses aloof, so it's going to engage you. It sure will. Oh Which yeah. I guess it negates all of what just happened. <laughs> There's 
there's a way you can like snap a card to another card and so then they're like stuck together. Um, I just don't remember how to do it offhand. There's like a shortcut for it too, like with everything in tabletop, but. Mm -hmm. Well, I can attempt to evade him and see what happens. All right, what is the plan? I need to move closer to the office. I need to do in the know. And you've got um, this Arkham officer on you. I do, but that might be all right. Um, in fact, it is all right. So should I in the know the crime scene of 225 because we will eventually be in the office and we are not going back to the room we need three more clues, correct? We do. Yes. So unless somebody else wants to go first. Not quite. Let Doesn't matter to me. I know what I'm doing. Uh, is there an easier location? Not in play. Nope. We never went to that many. No, I bet you the other ones have victory. Uh, <laughs> it's true. Yeah, that's a sound bet since the only two of the new locations we turned over actually did. I'll bet they all do. Well, if we're not in a super big hurry, I mean, if we, you know, we could spend some time going around. Well, I mean, I'm sure. It's worthwhile. I don't know. I don't if know. we come out of this with two victory points. <laughs> oh, there might be. There's probably victory in that third act. Okay. Probably. <laughs> and, you know, for winning the scenario, hopefully. Yeah. Maybe. All right. So here's what I'm going to do. Let, let's. Well, I don't understand. I'm going to. I tell, I'm telling you that I just do not have the controls. I know what like I'm supposed to be doing, but none of it. Like seems to work the way I expect it to. Okay. I'm I'm only at a four. Mm. Oh. I don't love that, but I'm gonna try it. <laughs> hey, that worked. Done. I'm gonna take that clue, which I can't grab. There we are. And he makes an attack of opportunity, which I will block with narrow escape. And then I'm going to get a plus two to evade him. Uh, wait. So Can you just auto what? evade him? Oh, no. no the location has to have evade. Right. Yes. So I'm going to have a four, five, Six. Okay. So he's evaded. You did it. Barely. And there he is. So you didn't have so, to take that attack from him, right? And you didn't, did you? I, I didn't take an attack. No, I canceled so canceled that I could get attack. a bonus Got it. On, on, the, on the evade. All right. So he is no longer driven by madness. Um... I'm going to exhaust pickpocketing to draw a card. Nice. And I guess I could try to parlay the hotel guest. I probably won't succeed, but is it? Uh, go for the room. I'll, I'll work on the hotel guest. OK. All right. Then I'm done. Go ahead, Tony. You said you knew what you were doing. Yep. All right, Arkham Officer. Get your comeuppance here. Chuck Fergie. I'm gonna do a one-two punch. For fast and two less. Well, actually, I can spend the resources. So I'm gonna get plus two of both of these tests, I believe. Yep. Because. Yep. Chuck is just plus. Please go down, 
while performing skill tests, so on the card. So I will be at uh, five, six, seven, eight for this first test. Yep. Okay. That's definitely. So he's up to two damage. And for this next test, I'll be at uh, nine. See. Yeah, okay, so there's nine, and I'll do two damage. <laughs> okay. This is Plus so one. swingy. <laughs> yeah, it's really weird. Okay, so now okay. this guy gets under our victory display. The victory display, our first victim. Let's put him up top. All right. Uh, oh, and that was fast, so that wasn't even an action yet. <laughs> oh, oh, my goodness. Not. Quick draw. Yeah. First action, I'm going to parlay with this mob enforcer. One, two, three, four. Got money to burn. <laughs> I, I, yeah, I do. Uh, okay, that was my first action. Second, I'm going to move over to the restaurant. And I'm going to pull down. Do I want to pull him down? Well, he's. Um, by the way, Chuck Fergus didn't have to take that damage. Oh, so he would kill Sergeant Monroe. Never mind. I didn't. I didn't want to kill the other yeah. guy, and we've got inspiring presence in hand. Got it. Which I'm hoping to combo at some point to heal him and use two events. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Um, yeah, I, I think I'll just go in and pull this guy down so he's not moving. Okay. Then I will move. I will parlay with some enraptured. Yeesh. Uh, what was I? I am a four five against a. Um. A three. Three. So I actually have to place a clue on my location. Oh man. Yeah, that's fine. All right, that's all right. I'll get it back because then I also get a charge on my gate box. She is discarded. And I am going to actually put out my Robes of Endless Knight. I'm getting the urge to go in the basement, guys. I just kind of think there's a victory point down there. I, if you want to go down there, I'm, I'm okay oh. with that. Oh, wait. I don't think we should go too crazy, but what are we looking at for doom? I don't know. We just cleared up so much. That's why I'm like, well, there's three in time. play for seven of 12. How many? Adjustments? Oh, seven of 12. We'll be eight of 12. Then we're going to get rid of two. So we'll be down to six. I only see, oh, there's that. But that guy's going to die. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He is definitely going to die. And I can go after the other art officer. And once we got one innocent, it doesn't sound like. <laughs> I mean, I go there's, all you in. know, 17 clues down there. We, I, it's, I'm still only one away from the office. I don't know. I guess we'll see what happens. Oh, yeah, this guy's going to hunt on me. Maybe I shouldn't have put this out yet. I should have just been... You need to run away. Well, you could gate box later. Even yeah, if he's right. engaged, you can use the gate box, right? You bet. That's what I'm going to do. And there's no guests in play, actually. So, which means he has Hunter. Yeah, which means he's Hunter. Oh, yeah, okay. It was actually better when there was a guest in <laughs> I'm going to guess at some point he would try and kill the guests or something. I don't know. That's weird. Yeah. Odd. Well, if he does engage you and I no, can successfully investigate, I could get the clue that's on your location and evade him. Yeah. <laughs> Next turn, right? Not this turn. Yeah, it's Obviously. Fine. fine. Okay. So that's end of round, right? This guy gets up. Enemy phase. Yeah. He's gonna engage. This guy engages me. 
Uh, I'm going to deny existence that attack. Yeah, that's no good. You don't want that. Uh, I take a damage. And then we upkeep. There's my wither. Oh, oh I thought you were about to say map. <laughs> no, I... I have leveled up withers now. I'm yeah, a very helps. happy person. That helps me. I've got robes of endless night. You know what? I could probably kill this guy too, but you know, Tony. <laughs> Why do that mediocrely what Tony can do awesomely? All right. Uh, looks like I, I got to put Doom on. Counter. Oh yeah, Doom. Counter cards. So we are at eight of twelve, right? Yeah. It is another hotel yeah. guest. <laughs> Okay. Uh, this yeah, one yeah. will spawn with, yeah, right? Oh, no, I'm in the hall. Yep. I'm in a hall. So there we are. That's beautiful. It's fine. Well, the crime scenes are far. Ish. Yep. A couple turns away, right? Uh, <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, oh, the restaurant is a hall, so I guess it has to go. Where are we? Okay. Violent outburst. Is he a humanoid? He's a humanoid. <gasps> All right. So we're going to get Walt for two. This is good. This is in the past. I didn't have trauma then. Oh, you didn't? Yeah. <laughs> Although I are you at two as well? Like actually, Luke is at two of five, uh, or you just have one? I've got endless robes of endless night and wit and green. Oh, what I meant was, in the actual campaign that we're playing. Oh, I just have um, I have one physical trauma, so I have four. Help. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. So that's yeah. us. Okay. Plan. So I can still do the thing that I said, which is try to investigate your location and evade your enemy for you. Uh, the enemy is going to attack you. The, the, sorry, the Arkham officer is then going to engage you and attack you. Because I gained a clue? Office location. All right. Um, I can put out some... I mean, I'm not terribly worried about that, but I also have obfuscation. Oh, that's not an attack of opportunity, though, is it? I wonder. I mean, Tony, no. how, how are you doing combat-wise this turn? Uh, let's see. I'm going to... Should be able to kill this guy. We'll probably take me two actions. And I can move somewhere else. That's... I think that's... So not two locations and then attacking. Oh, wait. Well, no, I can... a, it's a connected. It's connected. Never mind. I can pull the other officer to me if we want to do that as well. Oh. That works. I guess Maybe I should go not elite. Oh yeah, or I can take your... I've got a Spectral Razor. And I can deal... Oh. I would be up by three. Oh. Okay, so is that, that's what you would... I mean, it, it depends if this is getting a little too much for us and we just need to I need to flex my flex muscle. Do you want to kind of see how Tony's turn would go? Yeah. It maybe depends on how successful he is. All right. Um, okay, sure. Yeah, why don't you deal with the officer then? Okay. Because I'm looking at these hotel guests. Yeah. And I should probably stay here, so I might as well investigate this location. Okay. So I'll, I'll hit... Don't worry about my location. You can in-the-know other things. All right. But yes, Tony can go first. Sure. Okay. Uh, let's see. 
Chuck to play, clean them out. Gain two resources. Okay. Uh, I'm going to make that fast and plus two skill value. I am then going to chuck an inspiring presence at this as well. I can, if it's successful, I can ready an ally uh, and heal one damage and horror from it. Oh my goodness. So. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, nice. So that is a minus, minus two. Minus two? Yeah, there's two gifts, right? Yep. So minus two. Yeah. I'm definitely still way up. And that's five, six, seven. Minus two is five. Yep. Okay. So I deal one damage. Uh, Chuck readies. Heals a damage. Okay. Next action, I'm just going to use my switchblade. I'm at seven to three. Oh, yeah. Plus one is eight. Three, I get two damage on this Arkham Officer. He's gone. There's the victory display. Uh, use the liquid cigarette case. Five, top five. Oh, there we go. Okay. I've been looking for my guns. Nice. I found one. All right. Uh, then, last action. Actually, not my last action. Chuck Vergie will uh, make get over here fast and free. So I'm going to take this Ar other Arkham officer <laughs> from the next location over. Gauge him. Now I'm fighting. So... Let's see, I'm only at five. Actually, I'll spend the two resources and get plus two. So I'm at uh, seven to three. Where's that? Two and Chuck for uh, using Chuck's ability instead of oh, got it, got it. Yeah, you feel resources, yeah. I'll get plus three skill value minus yeah. just three. To the side. <laughs> it's a good thing I did that plus two because the minus three I now succeed. So, uh, one damage. Okay, then I will use my switchblade for my last action. I uh, love Tony, see. I love Tony. Yeah. yeah. Seven to three. Just hope. Ah, uh, okay. So I do one more damage. Okay. And that is me. All right. Robes of Endless Night. Spectral Razor. Yeah, he dead. Hey. <laughs> Whatever it is, it's clearly no longer human. All right. I am then going to put out wither while I can. And I will just straight up investigate this place. Auto fail. <laughs> the bag says no. Yeah, the bag has <laughs> said no a lot. It's been one of those games. It, it's yeah. pretty insane. Yeah. Uh, um... I, I, I'm just going to. I'm going to check out the basement. Uh, oh, I guess I should have read it, right? If we were going by that. The hum of machinery and the dim lighting make your hair stand on end. Exploring the basement will be difficult. Amidst the din, you think you hear footsteps echoing your own just a few paces behind. And there is victory here. Um, it, okay, I can test one, if I succeed in move a humanoid enemy at any location once toward the basement. <laughs> <laughs> well, it, after you defeat an enemy in the basement, move any number. Okay, so that, that has no relevance, but I mean, that's nice victory. It is. I got to make my okay. way over to the office anyways, before we can even do that thing. So, if I investigate now, I get one clue. But if I move the hotel guest to me, <laughs> I could get two. But I guess that's like what, you know, like, I mean, what I would save. That's, oh, it's a crime scene. So you get a horror. Oh, it is a crime or scene. A In fact, oh she's, so going she's now go going there. to move. She's going to go there. Yeah, she's going to be going there anyways. Yeah. Oh. 
Did it say crime scene what? on the side? It did, okay. <laughs> so I should have predicted that, is what you're saying. <laughs> yeah. Well, I think we moved yeah. that last hotel guest the wrong way, didn't we? Um, Maybe not. I don't know. Maybe not. All okay. right, all right. Um, yeah, I'll just... Whoops. I'll just investigate. Here. I'm at eight. So I get one clue. One sad clue. <laughs> and... I guess I can do in the know on the office. Does that make sense or does that mess up your plan? It does not mess up my plan. Okay. So now I have five against three. Oops. And that's a success. Thanks. Okay. That's me. Awesome. Please leave that one clue on the office. Okay. I will make use of it. Hmm. Or maybe I'll just have to pop to the basement. Okay. That's everybody, right? Yes. Okay. She moves down. Mm -hmm. So she gets a doom. It's not part of my plan. She can go up here. <laughs> sure. Yep. Yeah. And any other enemies? You have an enemy. Yep, I get attacked. One on Chuck. And upkeep. That's awesome. Tikatoy did a great job on that. It activates all your cards now. Backpack. You didn't really need it this time around, but there you go. <gasps> you nope. did get the segment of Onyx! That's amazing! Who? What? Me? Yeah. Oh, I did. I know. And, I and yet, the whole <laughs> the whole game, I did not choose it when I was searching my cards. But now, you know, um, it's ready to go off. Now that's so good with Trish. Yeah. So oh, yeah, you got Rook and only ten cards in your deck. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, if I can, yeah, take the time to actually put him out. But yeah, we're yeah. Good. So you can grab a clue from a location and evade an enemy or just evade an enemy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think one action for eventually getting the, the pendants. Pretty good trade-off. Yeah. Okay, one, two doom in play, plus our six. We are eight of twelve. Okay. Bad cards. Yeah. Mr. Ooh. Trombley, spawn in the foyer. He's a hunter. After Ooh, exactly. Mr. Trombley enters play, immediately resolve the hunter and patrol keywords on each other staff enemy in play, which we have none. Uh, Correct? We have a patrol. This hotel guest is now up here. He's She's a staff? Or is it just staff? Yes. Oh, just staff. Okay, never mind. Uh, then it there would be are. just the one engaged with Ben, but he's engaged. He's not a staff. So... He's not a staff either. Oh, he's not. That's right. Okay, we got lucky. He's just, he's just the cop. I think we killed all the staff. <laughs> They're buried a lot, a lot <laughs> in staff. room 225. <laughs> yeah, I've killed like five staff at this point, or like okay. ten all right, staff. This guy has a victory point. I'm excited. Yeah. Yep. Uh, I will... I'm going to go after Ben, I think. Okay. Trish, I'm going to go before you, if possible. Uh, yeah. yeah. I can go first if that... I'm, no, I, I, want to go, I want to go before you. Oh, I thought you said it. Never mind. No. I, I, okay, I want yeah, to no be, problem. I want to be greedy. <laughs> Tony, do you have a plan? Uh, not really a Good one. Let's see. I'm going to kill this guy, then I'm going to move over, and then just start pounding away at this guy. I don't have any shenanigans at the moment. 
but I might draw into something with my cigarette case. Okay. You want to go for it then? Sure. Okay, so I'm going to use my switchblade, seven to three. Uh, yeah, okay. I think I'll put overpower on this. Nine to three. What the? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. Seven to three. That kind of changes the plans. Uh, oh, I have to redo it now. Does that draw again? Yep. Only if you killed people. That's fine. So two. Five, yep. Five to three. I pass. He goes the victory display. Um. Cigarette case is only gonna look at the top two, but I just want to see if I can find something. Oh, <laughs> top two were both uh, weaknesses. So hey, there's that. So, uh, which one are you trying? <laughs> do I have to? Uh... Oh, yeah, I do. Yep. Okay. Well, then. Oh, okay. Uh, I guess I'm just putting this one into my hand. Oh, I see. All right. Uh, All right. Well, so that's two two actions. My third action is just going to be moving over, and unfortunately, but. Uh, oh well. Yeah, I'm trying to see if there's anything I can. Not really. Nothing I can do about that. I don't even know if I'm going to get him next time either. But uh, I'll just move. Got Mr. Trombley. Oh, I still got one more action, I guess, because now I can use. I got a bounty on him. Right. So. Oh, one yeah. Fight. I do have a spectral razor. I we might need it in the next act. Is my thought. Yeah. It's really good for hitting things in rooms where nobody's there. Right. Also, he's, uh, elite, isn't he? he's not elite. He's not. Seven to four. I'm just using my switchblade still. Times three. I did not fail, but I do one damage. Okay. Yeah. That's me. All right. Uh, I'm going to parlay. I'll ditch Wit to help this out. <laughs> what was no. I? A four minus. Yeah, no, that didn't happen. Uh. Really? You're going to make me lose out on four resources, you bloody hotel guest? For my second action, I'm withering the hotel guest. <laughs> okay. <laughs> She's dead. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, at this point, what's the diff, <laughs> right? Honestly, like, we already have... Actually, that's a good idea. Yeah, I'm hopping into my gate box. And, uh Here's the question. Sorry, 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 sorry. Can you wither an aloof enemy? No, I would have had to engage her first. So I did. I only asked because I was think thinking about doing the same to the hotel guest in my room. Realizing maybe I couldn't. You know, I wanted to jump into your area and get $4 from Crack the Case. Well, now I know that, yeah. <laughs> yep. Okay, so that was my whole turn. Getting rid of a hotel, a hotel guest. Yeah. Alright. I'm going to investigate eight against, no, nine against four. I'm going to take two clues. <laughs> there I am. Hmm. 
No, see, this is how it works. I cannot deal with this. All right. Oops. Sorry. I will. Yeah. Um. What? What? Oh, okay. I'm just putting. A You're point. not. What? It's all good. Oh. I picked okay. up one of your clues. <laughs> oh, I see. Yeah. I thought I only took one and put it on my board. Yep, I, and I gave you the other one. Okay, uh, yeah, I thought you had maybe done something like take it, took it back away because you thought I had taken nope. two. Um, All good. I'm going to look for the segment of Onyx, which I have to find, basically. Nope. And that and I guess I'll parlay the guest maybe I'll get it I'm one up yeah there's nothing here it's not an investigate so no and if I fail you can place a clue on your location to get rid of her Ooh, uh probably is worth it right i mean i can just get it back yeah so yeah there we go maybe you can crack the case next turn i might <laughs> yeah. I, maybe i can maybe i can <laughs> all right enemies You can take that. Well, you All can right. Take that Two health and one horror on you. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> when he does damage or horror, exhaust him. Deal a damage to a non-enemy, non-innocent enemy at his location. Is this one innocent? It's not. So he's gonna take a horror. Let's see. Yeah, he'll take the horror. And then, yeah. If I deal him the two damage, I could put the two damage also on. Uh, dealt any amount of damage or horror, exhaust him. Yep, you could put two damage on him. I think I'm gonna do that. It would kill Monroe, but. Yep. Maybe that's just the way Monroe. Going. I think that, yeah. He was two days away from retirement. I'm sorry. So what happens to him? <laughs> Does he go into the... I right. think that's why he has that, uh, you know, flavor text there. Good question. It doesn't say it doesn't remove him from the game. Say. I think he just gets discarded. Okay. Right? Is there anything else? that way. I don't know where you'd be discarded to, though. Guess in... Oh. oh, wait. No, no. This is a player back. This is a player back. Forget that. Yeah, that doesn't make any sense actually okay so i'm just gonna throw him over here he's done nobody controls him so he doesn't go to anyone's discard pal all right upkeep oh i like that there you go. and bad cards Noxious fumes. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, I'm the only one at my location, and I've got nothing. But um, that's okay. This is all right. All right, I'm up by one. Minus one. Draw and... a token. Yeah. Oh. It's all right. Dar. You passed. <laughs> you I passed. passed. 
I moved to a connecting location. Yeah. So I suppose we'll go here. Huh. Incriminating evidence. Uh, attached to the nearest non-crime scene location. I think that's my location. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, okay. So, attached location gains crime scene trait and plus two shroud. Uh, when you successfully investigate, discard this instead of discovering clues. Okay. Um. That's some interesting art. Yes, it's horrifying. Oh, man. Huh. Okay. Hmm. Hotel security nearest empty location is probably this one up here. Unless you want it closer to me, to, to you, Tony. Uh, you can be closer, I think. There he is. Yep. It's right there. Yep. You can be closer. Okay. Our turn. Once again. I'd like to go before Trish. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, gosh, I want that victory point. Oh, I was going to get the victory point. Oh, okay. Um, so what is the advantage of going before me? Oh. Or, or rather after. What, what, was, what was the question? So what I'm thinking... <laughs> What's happening? is it takes me one action to get to this location through my gate box. Okay. One action to investigate and crack the case. And then I move. And then okay. that puts me at your location with all of our clues. Right. That's my okay. thought. Did that work? Yep. Okay. That works. To the gate box. Witten, find me a map. No, she doesn't find me a map. <laughs> it is the fourth last card in my deck. No. <laughs> Uh, okay, I'm here. Oh, uh, um, I, I, you know what? Before you go, I guess you already, you already did it. Um, well, before you, before you come out, let's say, um, I'm about to put out the segment of Onyx. I could just take that clue, but then you wouldn't get the. Never mind, you wouldn't get cracked the case, and you don't want that. That's right. <laughs> so, never mind. We're going to read some signs. Yep, it was worth it. It was worth it. Because money. And then for my last action, I will move up here. Hi, Trish. Long time no see. Um, I brought one clue. <laughs> okay. I brought That's one right. clue to our party. But I also brought a lead. Incriminating evidence, eh? Let's see. So you are finished. I am finished my turn. With your turn. Okay. Uh, test. Zero. So what what we're looking for is a six. Um, but first, I'm going to take the clue off the location. I feel like I'm not going to use pendant right now. Um, oh wait. Okay. So I will take the last clue. And yeah. then let's test. Whoops. Yeah, whatever. Yeah. It's there. It's just not really uh, stacking. Okay. So. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have any pips to send you. I can. I'll just discard in the no. And so I'll have five. All right. Hopefully that will be enough. Well, so two. we get two. It's okay. It's okay. Yep. I could do it again. Yep, I mean, anything. That's what we need to do. Anything so above zero is helpful. 
is that, that well if you drop a clue on your location that becomes a minus one that's we can get the clue back right what is it right now this is minus three so we would put two clues on again and then we have to do it once more in any case right you're either yeah you're right I'm, I'm either investigating or we're doing this again um i don't know that almost seems like no difference let's just leave it okay yeah nope my turn's done mr morgan uh, all right Let's see, I am just going to try and switch blade Mr. Trombley here. Seven to four. Let's see, can I pump that up at all? The fun thing uh, is is that we can just exhaust somebody. <laughs> or just can if if Yeah. Yeah. One damage. Another action doing that again. Wasn't that free? Yep, that was the free one. And then for my first real action, let me do it again. And that kills him. Oh, sorry. Yep. Uh, and now this one kills him. The last one I was minus three, so I only was up by one. Yeah. Anyways, yep. So now he's dead in the victory display. One more victory point. There is uh, blood on our hands. <sighs> Yeah, well, but... that's for sure. Uh, I'm going to move over to this uh, dining or the restaurant again. Or what's the thing on it's... here? Uh, Spend two resources. You can order. Oh, take a horde to heal three damage. Yeah, probably not your bag. Hmm. And not right now. Maybe I could put one on Chuck at some point to heal damage, but... Uh, okay, so I got this dude. I'm going to use Chuck. Now a 1-2 punch, which will make it uh, fast. And plus 2 skill value, so I'm spending 2 resources. I love all these cards. I'm just playing Nathaniel for the first time right now. Yep. Yeah. And... Okay. There's so downsides one. too, but you know. <laughs> eight, eight against four on this first test. Well, okay. you did it. Uh, it's good. I, I still, did it. still did it. We're good. One damage. All I need. Second one. I'm at five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'll do a two, two damage. All right. That's a minus zero right now, right? There's no guess. That's correct. Mm -hmm. All right. He is gone. Boom. Well done. And you still have an action. Yep, I still have an action. Uh, okay, so I did the perfect amount of damage. I didn't get rid of that. Uh, I am going to. You know what? Let's put up my backpack now, and I'll get all my other weapons in my hand. <laughs> oh, I should use my cigarette case too. Uh. What was that last action? I was at nine. What did I draw on that last? What was that last token? I don't even remember. Good question. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I already. Uh, whatever. I'll just use my backpack here. And so I can search the top. Six cards. Okay. Perfect. Uh, let's see. It's that one and this thing. Oh, I shouldn't have put them out there. Should... No, I, it's, yeah, it seems to happen in the threat area too. It's got to be off the table, I guess. Except for your, yeah. your signature gun. It doesn't do it then. And that was it. Okay. Well, that's all I wanted. OK. 
Okay. That was me. That's everybody. Yep. Monsters. None. Upkeep. Uh, deduction. Okay. That's a thing. Sure, now. Yeah. We have seven Doom out of 12. And bad things. Hey, hotel security. The There's nearest empty basement. Yeah. Come on. Whatever, man. Oh, we advance at the end of the round, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. Okay, so they spawn at this hall. I'm going to put a bounty on them as uh, well. He's nearest crime scene location. Yep. Which is, Which it is, is, yeah. Oh. Because of the incriminating evidence. Right. Nauseous fumes. Uh oh. Now, uh, what? Well, that's the third time I've gotten this. Yeah, and I you hope I fail. I... Well, I'm, I'm. I don't want to move to a connecting location. Uh, I'm probably gonna fail this. So here we go. Yep, I failed it. I uh, take two damage, and I move to a connecting okay. location. Okay. That is that. Um, sorry. Do you discard the card? Sorry, I did. Okay, I have to take another look at this. Wait. There a it is. It's Where in is your, it? It's in your area now. Ah. If you succeed, move to a connecting location. Oh, never mind. I'll just take the two damage. All right. I also have nothing to contribute, so I'm up by one, and I pass, which means I have to leave, which is not what I wanted, but... Garbage. Well, where do I go? Oh, the crime scene. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's going to have to be. Because it's closer to Tony. You know what? It's okay if you move. Oh, no, it's not, because we have your clues. Yeah. I have three yeah. clues. God, you know what? I, I I should have foreseen something like this happening. <laughs> Why didn't you drop a clue on your location? No. <laughs> exactly. Why didn't I do that, When especially when I have an a, a way to automatically pick it back up? <laughs> I play this game so dumb. Oh well. Well, I could have picked it up, and then I then you wouldn't need to be here. Um, oh well. Okay. Uh, it's well, our turn. You hold on now. We have four on the card, right? Only two. Wait a minute. Oh, right. Yeah, there should be four. I thought there were. Oh, I thought we got four on there. I put them on my stack. That's what happened. There we go. Oh. There is four. So you, I I was have like, you have one. enough. I'm still one shot. Ah. Okay. Well, listen. <laughs> I don't mind if this hits me. It does. It's not going to. If I just walk away. I mean, that's. Either that, or I can kill it along, along my way as I. Yeah. Can you, can you kill it like this turn? Oh yeah, you don't have anything in front of you. Okay. I guess I'll go. Yeah. Um, Otherwise, I'm dragging it into the office. Yeah, I don't want that right now. I want my yeah. bounty back. Right. Uh, <laughs> so moving for one. I am going to. Well, I'll exhaust Chuck to play Slate of Hand for free, I guess. Get out my Colt. Which I guess I'm discarding this Chain of Dagger then? Yeah, okay, sure. so this was my discard. I was never going to use it. Alright. Uh, do you mind if I just attack across the table? Or Go ahead. No, go ahead. Okay, let's see. Let's see, I get five, six, yeah, so I'm at 
Went six with three. Pretty good. You know what? I'm gonna make it. Eight. I can Wait. help you with nothing. Oh Come no! On. I could give you what I could give you. Actually, I have one uh, fight to give you. Um, if if you need. Yeah, I'll just do it myself. So I'll, I'll use inspiring okay. presence just to make sure I'm pretty good. Then so seven to the three. <laughs> okay, it's a good thing I did that. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, okay, so I succeeded. Um, does two damage, so it's gone. I get the bounty, and I place one back on my contracts card. Uh, inspiring Presence readies Chuck and heals him. And so that was my free action. Second action, I'm going to go down to the basement. Got this hotel security. Uh, you don't want me killing him then, right? Oh, are you gonna? A, no, no, I wasn't he's going. Got to bounty. He's got a bounty. I'm assuming you want your bounties back, and that's your yeah. No, nope. oh, all good. Yes, all good. I just realized I'm not gonna kill him this turn. I don't think. I don't have any other way to. I could exhaust him. Mm. Oh, true. So at least he wouldn't hit me. Yeah. yeah. That would be. That would be fine, I guess. I've only got one action left, so I'm only gonna. Yeah. Okay. Let's use this Colt. Well, I, I guess I'm using my switchblade right now. I'm just doing seven four. <laughs> you get a okay. bounty. You get two bounties. Uh, I get a bounty in there, yeah. And I put one damage, two damage on this guy. Yeah. And that was five, six, seven, eight, nine to four, so five cards for my lucky cigarette case. And that is me. All right. Trish. Okay, I move. You. And we can do it. I guess. Yep. I'm testing four. Uh, here we go. Five. That's enough, right? Yeah, that's enough. We have lots of chances. Yeah. That's All right. <laughs> that's two. So okay. here is. I guess you're going to put a clue from closer to you, right? So I'll put one on. Okay. You'll put one on. I will discard one clue, and you have one. Yep. And that should bring us up to six. That is six. So now we are free to do whatever we want until the end of the round. Oh, because it doesn't happen just yet. Right. Okay. I swear to God, I just, I really don't understand <laughs> how I don't seem to be able to make this, like, anything move the way I want it to. It's totally bizarre. Maybe there's like just a slight lag or something. Maybe. I don't know. It's frustrating. Okay. So that was that was one action. No, two. Two. Yep. And um, I'm gonna exhaust your enemy, I guess. Okay. Okay. And then, well. Do I bother putting out? I might as well. Yeah, because now it's... There might be a boss fight. Maybe, maybe. All right. I don't know what this path I'm is, done. but I'm sure this path isn't going to be you all get to go home and have cake. <laughs> sure? Uh, pretty sure. So I'm going to draw a card. And I'm going to draw a card. And I'm going to draw a card. Yeah, you think I could yeah. draw my map? No. Not that I need my map. I've been functioning fairly well without it. It just helps. Oh, that was my turn. Hey, let's advance. Yeah. Catherine. Let's do it. 
Ooh, the truth. Read scenario interlude, the truth on page 10 of the rules booklet. Okay. How did you, now when we flip it, does it, I just missed what happened. Like, is that just, oh, that's, it doesn't, it, that's not, that's not like customized. That's just, we, that's on every, okay. That's on, yeah. 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 Just wondering like if there's, right. where is the scenario book? Right, it's uh, to the left of the play area. I there see. Okay. All right, we're going to do this. Uh, we'll just do this in order. I'll read the truth one. Catherine, you can continue. Your investigation is halted by Sergeant Monroe, the very same police sergeant who had spurned your earlier warnings about the Excelsior Hotel. He's clearly exasperated by all the strange happenings in the building and demands answers. Now listen here, he says, his hand twitching toward his holstered gun. I'm a reasonable man, but you're looking mighty suspicious. You better tell me everything that's going on right now, you understand? or you're going to take a one-way trip straight to the big house. We must decide, do we tell Sergeant Monroe the truth, or do we lie about our involvement? Well, we did kill a lot of his officers. <laughs> and him. <laughs> and him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ben, what's your thought? Hmm. Yeah, I don't know if they're going to believe us, no matter what. <laughs> so that's uh, truth three, then? Uh, yeah, lie about your involvement. You do the only thing you can think to do in the moment. Lie through your teeth. After all, there's no way the police would understand all the strange occurrences within the hotel. And even if they did, you don't expect them to turn a blind eye to all the evidence pointing in your direction. Mm -hmm. Sergeant Monroe will only believe you if you successfully covered up your involvement, if all of the following circumstances are true, skip to the truth six. Um, did we clean up the blood, hide the body, and tidy up the room? And, nope. nope. And are there no innocent enemies in the victory display? Nope. So, <laughs> truth four. Wait one sec, I get a... Uh... Oh... The investigators have not. So you either have to do all three or don't do all three. And in both cases, you can't Don't have any innocent enemies in the victor display. So we're screwed either way. Uh... For the police, for the, yeah, for the police to believe us. We, we, we can't have also killed a bunch of them, I guess. Okay, Ben, the truth four. Okay, uh, no. No, I don't believe you, the man says, unholtering his weapon. None of this checks out. You're coming with me, pal. You can sing your story down at the station. Raise your hands and he starts ushering you out of the room where there's a tremendous crash from another part of the hotel. The entire building shakes to its foundations and you hear guests screaming. What in the hell? He looks to the door, then to you. Stay put, he warns, or I swear, next time I see you, you're getting cuffed. He runs off to investigate the noise, mumbling about how he's getting too old for this job. <laughs> <laughs> uh, remove Sergeant Monroe from the game. Search the encounter deck, disco file, and all players for, for each copy of Arkham Officer and remove them from the game. Okay, so that's, none of that happens. Uh, shuffle the encounter disco pile into the encounter deck. Skip to truth seven. All right. Are you sure there's none left in the deck or discard pile? I'm absolutely positive. Okay. Yeah, there was only three. So do they get removed from the victory display? I guess not. Nope, it didn't, yeah, it didn't say victory display. Yeah. Thanks to your cunning investigation, you now have a better idea of what's going on. You're not the real culprit here. There is much more happening behind the scenes of the Excelsior Hotel, and you're just caught in the middle. Okay, resolve the text below based on which two lead assets are controlled by the players. So, ah. Catherine... It's going to be... Well, you don't have the time going, to unlock it. So just there the solution and manager's key. All right. The victim was performing horrible experiments within the Excelsior. He'd already transformed much of the staff, and you were to be the next in a long line of subjects. Only the experiment was a failure. Now it's up to you to put a stop to these horrible transformations by destroying the source of this concoction. Remove all doom from play. Ooh. Advance the act and agenda deck to 
the set aside the true culprit version eight. It is both the current act and the current agenda. Shuffle each staff enemy in the victory display into the encounter oh. deck. Uh, Mr. <laughs> what? Yeah. The, yeah, yeah. Darn it. Oh, that is oh. That's dirty. <laughs> Discard cards from the top of the encounter deck until one no, until two staff enemies are discarded and each get spawned in the foyer. So I guess. And then we attach the set aside harvested brain to room 212. Uh, sorry, what? Yeah. Has to be staff. 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 Yep. Staff. Two of them. There's one. There's, There's the two. next one, I think. Yeah, and they're in the foyer. Yep. We have a. Well, we have this. And we have the harvested brain. Okay, so I have to find number eight. This goes away. This goes away. Uh, did I miss that is anything? That's number, number three. Eight? That's number three. Oh, it was in yes. position number eight. Duh. I was tricked. Ooh. Okay, so did I miss anything else? Yep. We are now ready to continue playing. Okay. The true culprit. Okay, this is both. Each lead asset gains action. Remove one clue from this asset, search the encounter deck and discard pile for a staff enemy, and draw it. Shuffle the encounter deck. After a staff enemy is defeated, deal one horror to harvested brain. Objective if there's two plus three horror on harvested brain, advance. We just have to kill five staff members. Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, wait. There's a hotel guest sitting out here. She is not staff. No, but why? Sh she sh shouldn't she be in the deck? Only staff were shuffled in, apparently. Where's oh, this? you're right. You're uh, right. Yes, you're right. Yep. That's in the victory display. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we just need to kill five staff, which there's already three on the board. And we can dig for the other guy really easily. Yeah, so oh, yeah, there's let's, three out. Let's find the no. one with the well, okay. victory, victory, right? That was, we advanced at the end of the turn, or we did. Yep. So now, there's a doom in play for Mythos. Well, did we, is there hunter things that happened before? Oh, no, because that was the end. Okay, never mind. Did, did we upkeep? No. We didn't upkeep, so we should have done that earlier. Okay. There's my map. Not going to play it. Not now. <laughs> uh, maybe Perfect I will. timing. You know what? Maybe I will. Deck. Perfect timing deck. Withering. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Go ahead and draw your bad cards. We'll get the staff that we need. <laughs> oh, no. I have blood on my hands and. How many innocent Only one. Victory? Only one. Only one. Only, only one, one. Okay, I still will fail. Right? Um, because yeah, they were removed from the game. I, I, I am not at a crime scene location, right? Me, uh, or am I? No, I'm no. not. Actually, the the police officer is still there, right? Unless let me see. They removed them. <clears throat> I took three horror from this. Search the encounter deck, discard pile, and all play areas. Is the victory display a play area? 
with that. All right, I'm almost insane. <laughs> I'll be right back. She failed anyway. An out of play area. So play area must be in playing areas. Okay. Thinking. So they're still there. Yeah. Yep. Blood on your hands is uh, really bad. Yeah. So don't draw it. Where am I? I'm in the basement, so I'm as far away as I can get. One, two, three. Three willpower. Heck, you've um, done it before. Sure. Yeah, I'll go up two. Yep, you passed. Hey, I passed with my lucky cigarette case. Nauseous okay. fumes. Is anyone? Yeah, Trish is not going to like this. Okay. Uh... I'm just going to pitch burning the midnight oil for a fleetness test. Minus one. Yeah, that is a fail. So I take two damage. I think I'm going to discard my robes of endless night. They've done their job. And one damage on me. And it's our turn. Uh, yeah. I mean, there's the. She'll have to resolve the oh, mattress yeah. fume. Yeah, that's right. No, she's not going to like that. <laughs> oh, hey, guess what I did today. Okay. There's two plus. Forest, at the end of the investigation phase, each investigator at a taps location takes a damage and a horror. Each other investigator must either take one damage or one horror. So we are slowly going to get damaged by this harvested brain. Hello. Hi. Uh, she was though. Okay. So, yeah. um, gas attack. Are you joking? I, I drew that. I know. I don't, uh... At least it's damage. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I fail. It's two. Oh, you have one on Delilah. Nice. Okay, so at the end of the investigation phase, we're each going to take either a damage or a horror from Mr. Harvested Brain here. We don't have to be at his location, which is nice. Yeah, I was going to say, this seems... I think we're we're okay. We just have to, we just have to do that. Yeah. At the end of the investigation phase, each investigator at attached location takes one damage and one horror. Oh. Ah, but, okay. There is a path where you have to go into his room. Okay, let's uh, kill some things. What makes the most sense? Because Tony... That makes the most sense. Because we're the ones that can draw enemies. Tony can kill. I can kill... No. I could seriously injure this hotel security, but... I can flat out kill him right now. He does have a bounty. Tony might want oh, to... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If Tony wants it. Deliver the killing blow. Yeah, okay. I mean, I guess... I'm... I'm not too concerned, but... All right. So, uh... Yeah. Let me think for a second. Okay. How tough was that bad guy? The one with the bounty? Uh... Might as well pull him out. Since he's coming out. Yeah, I might... I'll look for him. Four and a five? Oh yeah, I can totally pull him out. Oh. 
but you have to resolve the hunter and patrol keywords on each other's staff enemy in play. We should probably try and kill some of these. Yeah, so I'm going to set them aside for the time being. Tony, if you don't mind. All right. Yeah. Would you, would you let me go first? Yeah. Sure. Right. Um, yeah, I'm just going to have to do this. It's fine. I'm doing this just so I can get more resources. Then I'm moving here. And then I'm going to, um, do I just auto evade him? I may want your auto evade. Okay, then I will try to evade him. I'm at five. I'm up by three. Or I guess, I guess we can save the auto evade for the end. Yeah. Okay, I succeed. Um, I'm even with it, but I succeed. So just leave him here for a second. And then I'm going to pay two resources to put two damage on him. Okay. Are you triggering pickpocketing? I will. Just I just lost track of what I was doing. Hold on. Gotcha. Did I? You did pay two resources. I, didn't... I already did? You already did. I watched you click it. OK. I really didn't think I did, but OK. Um, yeah, so I, I'm going to use that for a resource. And then he's exhausted, and I am. Oops. Let's see, can't stand up. There. I have one more action. And I am not entirely sure whether. I mean, I have a three fight, I'm even with it. Does it have retaliate? No. I suppose I could try. Just like punch it. Oh, and it I got it. I got one damage on. Okay. That's my turn. Okay. Whoops. All right. Huh? Tony. Uh, sure. Okay, so I'm just going to oh, knife this hotel security. Okay, so seven minus three is four. I still succeed. All right. One damage. We have one horror on the harvested brain. Yes. All right. Uh, let's see. One, two, three. Got my guns for real this time. So I probably won't need it. My knife has sufficed. Uh, <laughs> I will use an action to move up. Let's see. I guess I should kill the conspicuous staff. That's uh, you know what? I, I think I totally did four actions last turn now that I'm thinking about it because I played easy mark and I moved and I evaded. And oh, you played so easy there mark. No damage on that guy. All right. He is unhurt. Okay. <laughs> Seriously? Like, <laughs> I don't, I just know. don't know what I'm doing wrong. <laughs> uh, let's see. So that was my free. I put down a gun. I moved. You didn't need to put down the gun. Let's see. Okay. I guess I'm just going to go after your uh, conspicuous staff here. Yep. I'll use my switchblade. Seven to three. Lump by four. Okay. Uh, minus zero. 
No guests. I think it's minus... Oh, no, none in play. You're right. I thought it was the victory display one. So, conspicuous gap is gone. gone. Yeah. All right. Horror. The brain. The brain. And that is me. Oh. Okay. Oh, you don't have any clues either. Oh, shoot. Hmm? No, you spend a clue off your asset. Oh, right. right. Okay. Yeah. You're totally fine. Yeah. So I am spending one clue off this asset to pull Mr. Tremblay, which resolve the hunter and patrol keywords on each other enemy, staff enemy, and play. They don't hunt because they're exhausted, right? Or he was just ready. He was just ready. Sometimes, sometimes creatures can hunt when they're not, when they are exhausted. Yeah, right? I think they, I would think hunt. it would not ready, but it would hunt. It would but hunt. It would yeah. Not, not really move, though, because. Really? I thought it would just, re okay. I've always interpreted that as just, you know, readying because he would normally. Well, readying is different than. Oh, yeah, you're right. I think there's, I can't remember what scenario it was. It was so, it was an early, oh. early, early one. Hunter only goes off when they're ready. No, but there was there was one where it was said, I, it, I think it was the very first one, wasn't it? Where it's like the ghoul enemies all move. Oh, it wasn't hunt. It was they move toward the right. entrance. And it was like, what there was was. that was what I was thinking of. Okay. Yeah. I think we're all right. Okay. Yeah. Cool razor. And uh, what am I? I'm a five, six, seven versus a four. You know what? I'm going to pitch drawn to the flame and go up by four. Minus one. That is three damage to him. I am then going to wither. That's a seven. I am pitching my map. That's right. I dug my map just to pitch it. <laughs> Come on, All you can skull. Do at this point. Yes. Minus one. Minus two. He takes a damage and he loses a health. He is in the victory display. Oh. So is that three that we've killed now? Yes. That is three. And that was two actions. Well, we need one more staff enemy. Yeah, I don't really want to. Oh no! You don't really I, want him. <laughs> my my first action was pulling this the enemy. I know. Yeah, that's what it was. So I've done. Oh, my, yeah. I've done yeah. my three. Oh, okay. You had yeah. two attacks. Yeah. I see. I, I missed that part. All right. Uh, let me just double check. That I didn't miss something because he's not. Yeah. yeah. Um, at the end of the investigation phase, Harvested Brain does his thing. Okay, so we each take a damage or a horror. I will be taking a damage. Oh. Chuck will take my horror. Quentin Green can take some horror. And we are up to two Doom of six, and we can upkeep. I am definitely experiencing lag. What is going on? Okay. So I can just kill the hotel security, so I'm willing to take him. Oh, he has a bounty, though. Does it matter at this point? Uh, it's a probably doesn't matter. <laughs> it's a free action for him, but otherwise, yeah, it's probably okay. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's free for Delilah as well, so. Yeah, yeah. yeah, free for Delilah, and between the three of us, I'm sure we can kill a conspicuous staff member. Yeah, that comes so out. I've got another staff, I can put a bounty on that one, take it out if needed. All right, 
to encounter cards. Yeah, you know, I left the room where I'm in and I was so surprised every single person in my house was asleep. I was like, what, where, how late could it be? I was like, oh God. <laughs> oh yeah. It's pretty late. <laughs> oh, that's yeah. not good. Oh, you can place yeah. a clue on your location. Oh yeah, well that's... And your location is not even... Thank goodness uh... that I have some. How far am I away? I am... Two. One, two, three. Oh, it's one, two. You're right. So either way, this is not looking good. Just... Yeah, you're failing this. Sorry. No, I, I don't even know why I'm doing that. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I will place a clue on my location. Because that doesn't really matter. I'm frozen. There we go. Oh, uh, that goes to uh, the hotel security. Yeah, the security now has one extra health. <laughs> I just drew a conspicuous <laughs> staff member who goes to the nearest crime oh, nice. scene location. All right. Uh, sure, I'll take that one, and I'll put a bounty on it. I mean, it's not horrible. It's just irritating. <laughs> and it's our turn. Well, I mean, I can I can start and see yep. if I kill anything. <laughs> Go ahead, Tony. Light her up. All right. I, mean, I, I honestly, actually, I could do this uh, on Tony's turn. Oh, yeah. 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 Uh, I'm so watch this. It's loot. They lose this. So Tony. Oh yeah, and then just Delilah shoot it. That's awesome. Yeah. All right. Yep. Yeah. Uh, so I'm at five, six, seven, eight to the three on this conspicuous staff. And you finish with an wow. elder sign. Beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> Boom. Tony. Kills that one. It's just the triumphant end. So yeah. How many elder signs? I wonder. If we counted them up, it would be like six or seven. That uh, you we, can, we can find out here. We can look at the stats. Yep. I pulled... Oh. Like, person, personally, I think you pulled six. <laughs> That's the way it seems. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Elder Sign, I pulled three. Duh. Oh, it seemed like so many more. Catherine but... pulled three auto fails and three Elder Signs. So <laughs> That's did... how our game went. Yeah. So did Ben. <laughs> That is what I did too. Yeah, three of both. I drew three oh. auto fails and one elder sign. <laughs> That's remarkable. It what is. was the bag filled with auto fails and elder signs? Yeah, what the heck? I did. I did use the standard. Nope, it's still there. Okay. All right, so we get to advance. That brain was not that tough. I have to say. No, no, it wasn't. But the police officers were way more difficult <laughs> to deal with. Uh, pawn on the cerebral board. Okay, Ben, you can read the last half. Okay. Uh, if this is in advance, yep, complete the You stand in the lobby of the hotel, the building suddenly silent and seemingly empty. Hold the bottle of the strange liquid up to the light and consider its contents again. Your eye twitches as it traces the swirling, churning green solution within, and you shudder as you wonder what other effects this concoction may hold. You slide the bottle into your pocket, finding some measure of comfort in knowing that the strange goings-on of the Excelsior have been put to rest, at least for now. R1. Woo! Go us. Oops. Oh, yeah, you can also uh, resign. <laughs> yeah, just right away. Okay, nobody will ever believe what you witnessed at the Excelsior. Not three days later, the hotel was open again. Like nothing ever happened. You know better, though. You witnessed it all firsthand. The events continue to haunt your dreams and your waking thoughts. Even now, you go out of your way to avoid the Excelsior. The weeks have passed, and there have been no sign of any nefarious schemes within its accursed walls. The only thing that can quiet the echoing memories of that horrible experience is a visit to the local speakeasy. But all the booze in the world can't keep the grisly visions from your nightmares, waking you in the dead of night with a violent start, soaked in sweat. That's when you notice the person asking around town about the Excelsior. Innocent questions at first, but more prodding with each passing day. Surely they will believe you. 
Somebody has to. You may have broken free of the Excelsior's grasp, but there will be other victims. Of that you are sure. You grab a piece of paper and hastily scribble a note. It's all a facade. Room 225. Tonight. It's not over. If they can see past the veil of the Excelsior's operations, then maybe others can too. It may not be too late to stop it all from happening again. <laughs> <laughs> Your campaign log record the Excelsior is quiet for now. The elite investigator must add what has been oh, done. <laughs> you can't parlay. Okay, what is what is that? What uh, campaign is that That's... really bad in? Oh, Innsmouth, I mean, for one. Yeah, Innsmouth, if you do it early. I think that's bad for Forgotten Age if you do it later. If I'm remembering correctly. Wow. I like some important part, at least. Uh, they may also choose to add the Bloodstained Dagger story asset to their deck as well. Cool. Uh, the, if the police are on your side, nope. <laughs> <laughs> if no. the police don't believe you, do not add Sergeant Monroe to any investigator's deck. Additionally, if there's at least one police enemy Ooh. in the victory display, search the collection for a detective or madness weakness and add it to the lead investigator's deck. I didn't remember any of that. Thank goodness neither of us <laughs> is the lead investigator. Okay. I mean, <laughs> that is yeah. brutal. Yeah. <laughs> Each investigator equal he earns victory X, which I believe is four. I think you're right. Yeah. Three, four. Yep. So what have we got? We had this one. That one had victory. All of the ones you uh, didn't the go The balcony to. did not. Oh. It's an. It's a way you can auto defeat enemies by pushing that them was... off the balcony. <laughs> <laughs> you take horror, but you push them off the balcony. Because <laughs> oh, that was one that was in setup. Yeah. Yep. All the others, the ones that came out, all had victory. Yeah, okay, so we had two that we could have gone. And that is Murder at the Excelsior. <laughs> well, that was fun. The only other uh, enemy I can remember, I, I know I said I played this twice, but... Maybe I got defeated early the second time. The only one I can remember is the brain. So I've been up. <laughs> I need to maybe yeah. deliberately seed the leads next time I play so I can see some other outcomes because I have no idea. Well, the brain is not, must be in more, or is in more than one because I had one where I had to go up to the brain and then pass the clues for my assets to the brain. That was completely different. Well, I guess if you have the solution, the sinister solution. Yeah, I mean, it looks like there's a bad guy for each whatever, one. Whatever, yeah. Yeah, there's a giant Mego. A giant Mego. Oh, yeah, there's some big enemies in there. Oof. A shambler. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, cultist. That looks cool. The hotel manager. <laughs> Ooh. Yikes. Vengeful specter. Yeah. Victory 2. Yeah, these would have all had victory 2. Whereas we just, had, we just had the brain. No yeah. victory. It was. <laughs> yeah. It was, it was a bit easier, so I could. Yeah. yeah. He's ancient and science. <laughs> That's a absolutely disgusting picture. The otherworldly meddler. Oof! It's horrible. I guess so is the hotel manager. <laughs> That's the worst. <laughs> <laughs> Gross. Yeah. God. Oh god, I just read the text, the fourth text on Dimensional Shambler. We would have been dead. All of us would have been with that you know that symbol would have been revealed. Oh which <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> Yikes. I guess just never have it attack you. Okay. <laughs>
Oh, and you remove him <laughs> from the game. Ooh. Oh my god. That looks like E.T. E.T. in his later years. His drugged out years. Wolfman. Wolfman E.T. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well. Good game. Yeah. I feel yeah. happy with our four victory points even though. We yep. could have gotten a lot more, I suppose. But we could have, but it's not bad. <laughs> hey, it's a best so far, I think. I, I was, yeah, I was, ha you know, pretty happy with the way my deck was going. Yeah, you know? it, uh, I think I made some good choices. I think so too. I like your strategy of going later. Yeah, I still feel like you know the the tr the treacheries get me more often than not. Yeah. So. I mean, I don't have a lot of skills in the deck, but I mean, you, you know, you handle this isn't a bad one. Yeah, you've got a Mystic in the team now, and I'm packing upgraded Witten, so I get mm -hmm. the will boost. Yeah, I am adaptable. I can throw it in. You are. Um, my flex worked amazing. I loved it. I kind of did a bit of bookkeeping cleaning the table of hotel gas but a bit of everything some combat some clean mm -hmm. and <laughs> Ben that deck was fun to watch oh yeah <laughs> he's like, oh, it's fun, it fun. Right? but with Chuck man it is <laughs> Chuck is just ridiculous so. I know I love yeah. seeing him work well so that was fun <laughs> yeah so is he going to get tabooed next <laughs> he's already very expensive he is Yes. So, I mean, what could they do? Just say yeah. banned? I don't know. I love it though. At, I hope I would never. I would never listen to it. <laughs> yeah. They make him cost more experience. Yeah, I mean, they can make him exceptional or something. I guess. Yeah. All right. Well, it is late for everybody, so we will close it down sure. here. Uh, thanks everyone yeah. for watching. Thank you guys for playing. It was a blast. And we will catch you next week. Good night. Good night. Bye-bye.